got a uh, good start. I don't think I don't, I don't think you keep this hand against any deck. That's probably not. This hand is really borderline against Rug too, but I don't like going to five yeah. in a resource fight. Yeah, on a draw, this looks looks. That's whatever. I definitely don't. You want can't. That. <laughs> like you. Oh, uh, you can't not keep this. <laughs> Uh, I don't only play depths. I only play depths in the leagues, uh, Rodrigo. So I'll test against friends and other matchups. Yeah, that looks like Rogue. I think Trop and the Delver is a pretty safe bet that it's Rogue. So here I think we have to fetch Underground Sea and hope it lives for the turn. Do we fire off Inquisition or thoughts, or just nothing? Uh, I think we fire off one of them. If we put them on Daze, maybe. I mean, Thoughtseize, Daze is fine. Maybe Thoughtseize is better to not lose the life. Um, but. I think like, Inquisition's better. That way we can uh, save on the what do you call it, the Force of Will, if we need to take that in the future. Yeah, it's 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 whether you may need to take a Force out of their hand versus whether you want to save the two life by getting them to Daze this. Okay, so. Alright. Oh, we're not having a land anymore. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't appear that way. I think you take the spells there or the... I mean, it's it's ugly no matter what. I think you take the spells there. I believe that is the call. This actually... Yeah, this is tough. Uh, if, if he flips Delver and then Wastelands are just dead. <laughs> I mean, this line, this line gives them at least the... Uh, the bait of maybe they jam Tarmgoyf. Okay. So at least we'll get to resolve our... They don't have a blue card for force, so at least we get to resolve our Brainstorm and hopefully find extra lands. Yeah, if we can find, like, a land... But this this particular draw on the play against our hand is going to be very tough to beat. I mean, we can't even we can't even draw a second black and play the Hex Mage because they drew the Forge Bolt. So... It, it isn't was... a red man. They don't have red mana. Oh, that's... Yeah, but if, they, if we if we slam hex mage and they draw the a fetch land, we just we're out of the game entirely. Um, huh? So, is there an uh is there an argument to wasteland their wasteland now? Um, yeah, I think the I think the possibility here is we probably just want to brainstorm this turn and see what we find. Yeah, if you brainstorm and then wasteland their wasteland, it's possible. Yeah. Oh, that's even better. Now oh, that's pretty good. Now with the needle. Okay, so... Here what I think we do is... Hmm. That's interesting. Do we want to actually resolve Sylvan Scrying this turn? Um... What do you... You discard the gemstone mine, play the bayou... What yeah. are you putting back? Thoughtseize? Uh, yeah, it's tough because we have to play around what we think they're going to draw next turn. Um, if we think they're going to draw a blue card, we really need the Thoughtseize to get the Force out of their hand for the Hex Mage. Um, if we get them to Brick for one turn um, on a blue card, we could chuck the Thoughtseize, but that's the risk, is that... Bro, we're also on a, so a three-turn clock. Yeah. So... Huh. Yeah, we can't play around everything, so I think we have to hope that they brick on a um, on a blue card here. I don't think, yeah, we, can, I think, I don't think I, we can afford yeah. to keep Thoughtseize. Yeah. So I think Thoughtseize goes back, and I think Wasteland goes back, and we try to resolve. Hmm. I don't know. I, I feel like maybe, yeah, the need. So we're putting back Wasteland, Thoughtseize? Yeah, Wasteland takes a full extra turn to play that way. Um, if they force we're the needle, scrying. if they force the needle, they force the needle. They were gonna force the hex mage anyway. So I think we just have to accept that their clock's fast enough that we're gonna lose the force of will. Um, so we're not gonna get an extra turn to play the wasteland and then play the depths behind it. I think that's too slow. If that makes any sense, and we're gonna lose the force anyway, so we might as well try to resolve needle and hex mage next turn. So basically, we'll have three yeah. three mana sources. Yeah. We try to re resolve the needle first, see if that happens, yeah. and then play the hex mage depths. 
Yeah, so we're just dead to blue card. Pretty much, yeah. And probably several other things too, but I think with where we're at, this is the best. I mean, at least we are, at least we are, uh, it was way, it was way worse before though, so. Yeah, the brainstorm was good. Or at least got us to a place where we at least have a um, theoretical line that can win the game. Because um, part of the problem is also they have a blocker, so this Goyf is going to get an extra hit on the back end too. That we have to survive. So like, what? A, what? A, we don't even have any good, like, actual good draws to. Like, he decides to wasteland here. If he wastelands here, that's fine. We just play the hex mage, right? Yeah, we still died to blue card, but whatever. Yeah, we can't do anything about that. Well, that sort of might matter. Oh, it's the power. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> Well, we'll see. Jury step we'll power. See. He, he didn't do anything, so he probably didn't draw a land. Yeah. Drew the blue card. Oh, uh, uh, alright, we're dead. <laughs> uh, we're not. Yeah, we are. We're dead. Nah, no, we're, we're just dead, because we attacked for six. We go to four. Can't beat the wasteland. Yeah, we have to basically. Um... Hope he doesn't. Hope he doesn't. Gets out of play magic. Yeah, pretty much. Maybe he uh, F6 is here. He did not F6. <laughs> yeah, you try to block and then, yeah, it's not happening. <laughs> Being on the draw, pretty bad. Yeah, I mean, we, we win this game on the play, but it's a play draw game, it's fine. That's what Rogue does. So our outs here are Brainstorm into Crop Rotation, or Depth Hex Mage. <laughs> That's asking for a lot. Because <laughs> then we shuffle away the Sejuri step too. Oh, now we're dead. Uh, we weren't dead if we drew exactly Hex Mage Depths. We wouldn't have needed to shuffle. We could have hid the step on top. Uh, that's fair enough. But yeah, we were definitely um, we were definitely thin there. Their start was really uh, good, and ours was um, not particularly great. Do you keep bog in this matchup? Um, it's better than against uh, traditional old like uh, Delver decks. Like normally, well, actually now that might actually change now with uh, Dreadhorde being a card. Um, but normally, I don't care like, to have bog against most Delver decks, but some of them and in a deck that has goose and goif it's actually pretty good so i actually don't mind having the extra land but I think we can yeah having extra land against delver is like solid it's actually possible we're supposed to just go down an extra diamond too since we're on the play but uh, all right, this seems all right. This kind of seems good. It's just missing an Ouroboros. Yeah, I don't like trying to resolve crop rotations against this deck. They have so much soft counter magic and forces. Yeah, but yeah. the fact that we have a turn one needle and any land gets us to the combo. One of the problems is his list is running straight old school rug. I saw it a couple of days ago. And, um, the submerge. Yes, he has two copies of submerge. Yeah, we can always rotate the the trop. Yeah, but then we're playing right into the. Um, it's possible that maybe I was just supposed to do that there before he even got a land, rotate into Urborg, and then cast needle. But that's pretty. We do we do we do just try to scrying for Urborg here. Yeah, that seems reasonable because if that somehow resolves. Um, then we get like, position. I mean, and, yeah, like, wow. I mean, okay. we, were, we were gonna get counter magic. Um, yeah, it's so possible. Wow. It's possible he has grudge and we're gonna get blown out by this. Um, I think I think he is, uh, he probably has a uh, stifle. That's, that's probably, uh, that's definitely a possibility. He does have the stifle and he does have the grudge. Uh, uh, so, you know, if he if he goes for ancient grudge, that means he can't uh, cast any of the goyfs. Uh, no, he's gonna he's gonna grudge on our end step. 
Yeah, like, so, so if he grudges on end stuff, he actually just does nothing now. Like, his hand does nothing. Uh, well, his hand actually, he's gonna need to draw a counter spell because we're gonna crop into our own wasteland. Which he can't actually. Uh, he's, he's gonna need to draw another. I think he, yeah, his hand does actually nothing. Yeah, because we're gonna crop our green source away for wasteland. Um, which he can't currently stop and then play the depths. And I don't think he has an out to that. Unless he actually just drew Hex Mage. Or just drew um, Stifle. That works too. Well, now we can do everything. Oh, Yay. I don't think he was going to be able to beat this anyway. But it'll be nice to know exactly what we have to deal with. Oh, all right, he's dead. Uh, yeah. Did you board on the ghost quarter? Uh, pretty sure I did, but I'll double check. Yeah, ghost quarter's in. Is he playing Vapor Snake? Uh, I don't think so. I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do we make it now? Make it now, right? Uh, yeah, there's no reason to let him draw a wasteland here. Yeah, I was like, wait, don't, don't. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you're correct, Rodrigo. Um, I don't think he had an out either way, but yes, that would have been a turn faster. Yeah, I don't. I don't think his hand was very, very good. <laughs> I mean, I think the he kept it. Hand. I think he. I think he kept it on the back of Grudge Wasteland. So. Uh, That's fair. Uh, <laughs> oh, I know. I know why there's a step in your hand. That's a, that, 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 that's a mulligan. You're, you're, you're basically on a 5 already. Or six. Jesus. Uh, Fox Diamond. Why? I think it's a keep, though. Uh, yeah, I think we want this. Uh, oddly. Yeah, I, I think we need to force through the Sylvan Scrying. Yeah, well, I think that's what it is. I think we're playing both Mox Diamonds, Stage, Duress, Scrying, and hoping he doesn't have a Wasteland. I think that's the, I think that's the line. A uh, brainstorm, or how far? Do you do you play into the days? Uh, I don't think so. I think we wait. We, uh, yeah. I mean, we're basically beyond dead if he dazes this play. Ah, we are. We're 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 in trouble. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna play this to play around spell peers. <laughs> wow. Alright, we're in big trouble. Like, rug, Rug's clock is pretty garbage. Yeah. Um, he may give us some time, but. This isn't exactly a good spot. We basically need two pieces. A stage, we can copy his wasteland and play that game. 
but then we're starting from from the ground up and he has five cards plus any oh, additional sure. he did it for us any additional uh, as well as this now. thursday is a popular day for like stream Yes. Jarvis is streaming. Jarvis is streaming too. Um, I think Carrie's trying to mute um, because he has background noise. That's why it's cutting. Let's start. Oh. <laughs> that's a, that's a yikes. Yeah, as bad as this is, I think we're just not even bothering the thoughts he's in doing this do we do we do we f do we fetch now to play I was just full uh shit yeah that was yeah i didn't have a stop on his upkeep i would have 100 percent. oh wait now i definitely need to uh, oh should have fetched in response to ponder yeah, i didn't have stops on on either of his phases yeah now i'm gonna get nailed by that Wow. Yeah, that was bad. I don't think we're winning this game anyway, but that was really bad. We can still thought seize the stifle. Uh, yeah, I guess it's worth waiting to do that. Yeah, like you might as well, like at this point you can't, might as well thought seize and try to get information. Yep. Big. Look at that. Ah, uh, just... yeah, that looks, that looks pretty bad. Actually, I, I mean, we... This. I should have let this submerge. Oh, uh, but... wow. That, that hand looks uh, pretty good. Yeah, I mean, if we, had an abrupt, if we had an abrupt decay, his hand does nothing. <laughs> My dogs are having a grand old time. Yeah, no, I, w I was gonna say it sounded like a motor. <laughs> yeah, they're really going at it. Uh, I turned the TV off on them and. This is a... Uh... Oh, he has a wasteland to back it up? Okay. Uh, if we draw if we draw the K. If we draw if we draw the K. Yeah, we would have uh had a uh, non zero shot. That was um We we got rugged. There's not much we can do. We got rugged. <laughs> yep. Yeah, didn't play very well either. It would have, uh, who knows if we could have drawn a decay or another brainstorm to try and get back into it if I'd shuffled at the appropriate time. But. I don't think it ended up mattering. No. The, he, the fact that he hit the second stifle, it didn't, it didn't really matter. Oh, wow, this is, uh. Oh, man, that's Maverick. Well, it sucks. <laughs> uh. We're gonna beat Maverick. This is probably the kind of hand we're going to do it with. We have a yeah, three, way, three ways to uh, three ways to fight. Um, oh, it's four color loam. That's actually. Uh, if he goes chalice, if he goes chalice on one. Jesus. Ow. Well, we technically do have a reset versus that with the hex mage, but. We're gonna, okay, get, waste, we're gonna get wastelanded in the process of doing that. And that's assuming he doesn't just jam something broken here. That's a good one. I think we should have wasted his wasteland. Because, uh, like, because you know how he played that way, the mana source? Or color loves bad. Yeah, you might be right. I don't know that that's a line we can go down now, though, with him having Bob. Oh yeah, it doesn't matter now. <laughs> Ow, does he have a land? Didn't look that way. Ooh, that's that's good for us. Uh I'm almost a fan of Wasteland anyways. Yeah, I think I'm... Because you can still Wasteland them. Sylvan Scrum. 
So I almost think I'm... Hmm. I almost think I want to get the depths here. And then play a land to keep Stifle up. You can, uh, I guess what's Stifle? Yep. I have Underground Sea. Uh, I don't know. I, I, I think uh, the way. <laughs> what's that? I, I think the Wasteland line looks pretty attractive. He is the Knight of the Reliquary, so that card is just so. Well, we actually we, have, we actually have two answers to the Knight of the Reliquary next turn. Yeah, it's true. If you're popping the Chalice. Yeah. This is interesting. Yeah, scrying for scrying for deaths and and what it does. His hand is probably like full of uh what? Lilia. Yeah, that's definitely possible. There's another knight. <laughs> well, it, did he hit a land? Oh he did. Oh he, he can't play knight. Yeah, he, he he can't play knight. That's pretty good. This Liliana. Another dark compound. is an interesting spot so I'm thinking we huh. this looks kind of rough because we can't do wasteland and have deaths activation stifle <laughs> yeah well we can we can have one stifle up, but we can't beat Wasteland plus another effect, essentially. So we could play a second Hex Mage. Oh, or attack, activate the first Hex Mage, resetting this, play the second Hex Mage, play the Depths with the Polluted Delta up. So we could pass with Hex Mage Depths up with a stifle up, um, but that only beats this. If he draws a second Wasteland or a Ghost Quarter or another effect that we have to deal with. Um, yeah, he, yeah, he, he could. He... He could draw like. <laughs> yeah, I, I still think that's the best line because we we really want both of these up. The you know, the only other option yeah. is giving him three additional draws by giving him an extra turn. So I think. Yeah. Uh, I think we want. I think going. Yeah, going, going for it seems good. I think we need to put him for, to the test. So, we, so the bob and the, I think the he probably had the bob in his hand. Before. Probably. So his hand is like so his hand is like what night night three on. Nine. Yeah, plus the three cards he's gonna draw this turn, and we can't just jam immediately because we just straight up lose to Liliana. Um, so I think we have to see how his turn starts, and as soon as he takes takes an action, then we go. Do we fetch first here? Yeah, that's what I'm looking at. I don't think we want to expose the blue source though, because if we have. I mean, but if, but if he's wastelanding the blue source. Yeah, 
the timing of this is weird. Like, do we want to leave just two X mages on board um, to like dissuade him from playing, say, Liliana, or do we want to pop this now? Because if we're using I, this, I, 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 we'll wait, right? I think we just played X mage, played Sega. Line. Yeah, that sounds better to me. Like that way, he doesn't also get like free damage because he's at twelve. <laughs> Wait, the hex mages are a three turn clock. <laughs> yeah, we do get a little bit of information too. We'll see his two draws during his. Um... So like if he flips like wasteland, wasteland or something. Yeah, then we have to go. Chalice is interesting. Okay, so he's got a second wasteland. Um. Oh, yeah, um... I don't think he's going to tap one, so I think, do we just accept that we lose to Caracas, or? I don't, I don't think he has Caracas. I think he is. You think he has I, I think, I think he has Liliana. Well, I don't know that we can beat that. Do we, do we not beat that next turn? Um, if we play, if we play Wasteland, and we can Wasteland that Wasteland, and then stifle the other way slide? Uh, no. I guess we're this. I, no, I guess, we're, I guess still, we're, we're still down to one creature because we have to, to be able to cast these, we have to shut off the chalice yeah. to sack the chalice. So yeah. We, we don't do that. Oh, that's fair enough. So I think. I think you go for it and hope for the best here. <laughs> yeah. Do you think he'd. No, no, he's too good. I guess. Uh, I, mean, I, think, I, think I think he's best. For, I think you've. Yeah, against somebody I didn't know, I think I'd actually just try and sack a Hex Mage on Depths and see what happens, and see if he bites and tries to Wasteland. Um, but I don't think he's going to fall for that. Yeah, that seems reasonable. So I don't think this is getting any better. I think I'm just gonna go for it. Yeah, just go for it. Like he has it, he has it. This matchup's hard. <laughs> Cause he, he hasn't Yeah. We can we can get got real hard by abrupt decay. Uh yes, that's also a possibility. No, no, you're, you're oh, I did that wrong. Yeah, that was great. I'm gonna shame concede to that. Uh, there was, there's a there's a really slight delay here, so I was like, no, no. <laughs> yeah, streaming's hard. That was awkward. Um, yep. Yeah, that that turn one turn one chalice was pretty brutal. I'll have to ask him afterwards if um. If he, if he had the Liliana. Yeah. Se sequencing is hard. <laughs> yeah. We're talking about this uh, You cut out bad there. I didn't hear you at all. Oh no, no. We, we were just we were just talking about the stifle. Exclamation chalice and stifle. Ugh. So he oof. just he just said entered into the chat that he was dead. Yeah. Oof. Wah, wah. So yeah, we had a couple of lines that would have ended up winning that game. I don't I'm not in love with going after the wasteland with the wasteland on turn one or whatever that was. Um, but yeah, the lines we think at the end would have been fine. Because be like wasteland is usually 
unless he has a land to follow up. Seems alright. Turn one, turn one thoughtsies. Yeah, turn two, brainstorm plus shuffle plus map at worst. Assassin's trophy for. Did you just pass priority? Yes, I did. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, did you just pass pro? Oh, you kept on punishing fire. Uh. I think we take the diamond. Oh, I think last hope. Wow. Last hope. I think not you take very good. So I think I actually agree that this is the diamond. He's gonna drop diamond though. That's how it always works. You take diamond anyways, and hope he doesn't gonna, draw. I think he's gonna snap away his land us, to be honest. Because his hand does actual nothing. I think he just let's maybe assume. Why did he discard? What's that? Why did he keep. Oh god, it's. <laughs> nah, no, I'm, I'm kind of surprised he he have he has like last hope. Like, especially knowing knowing your deck doesn't really play. You know, any of those creature. Oh, there's a creature. Yeah. S speak of the devil. So. So, I guess the play here is to... Yeah, Needle seems real. Yeah, the problem is he's going to... Well... If he wastes Lance, he can't play. Yeah, if he wastes Lance, Trop, we have to Crop Rot, though. And yeah. Do another... I think he just... Oh, I like that, because that way we can, we, can, we can go right into another colored source. Um, and then play Depths, get... A... get they map for stage, and then next turn we have the full combo plus complete safekeeper. So yep. I think that looks seems, seems, uh, seems, seems solid. Let's play the needle out. Wow. Hope that doesn't mean he drew. Uh... I think he doesn't want to play into Crop Rot. Uh, so. Now we still want to wait on the safekeeper, I think, because of Liliana. Or he has abrupt decay. Uh, it's also possible. Didn't cast it if he did. If he casts any three drop here, I think we're fine. You don't think this deck runs Council's Judgment, do you? <laughs> no. I <laughs> white already. <laughs> Good luck casting white. Good luck. Oh. It's oh that's kind of annoying. Uh, uh, so here I think we have to chuck the trophy. Yeah, ch chucking the trophy seems fine. I mean, he's probably chucking the P fire at the Dried Arbor. Thank you. Do we even actually bother no. with the safekeeper? No, no, I don't think we do. You can get. Yeah, so we just pass here, and then we have crop rot I think we... protection, right? I think we just pass here. Yeah, I think we just pass here. GQ. The crack is for whatever he wins. Yeah, and we even have uh, 
the protection from what you call it, um, abrupt decay as well. This is crop rot for the ghost quarter in response to abrupt decay. Yeah. No, I, I, th I think he's dead. Okay. Unless I mean, he has something like Assassin's Liliana's. Trophy. Assassin's Trophy would do it. Yeah, unless he has like Liliana, or at end step, if he doesn't play land, we can just uh, float our mana, sacrifice the Arbor, and then he can't trophy. Uh, that also works, yeah. Looks like he's going to make a play, though, so that's not going to be a thing. This was an odd sequence. I wonder what he's doing. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea. He's just running out of that would that would dead. Fitting and cycling up. Oh no, the sacrifice Urborg line works now. What's that? The, the sacrifice Urborg line works now. Yeah, I wasn't even gonna do that. I was actually going to. Um... Uh, we gotta be plow. We need to be. We need to play around plow. Well, what I was gonna do was end the end the second main phase. I was going to crop drop into a wasteland and wasteland savanna. You can't. There's a pie they needle. Oh, ghost. Oh, this deck doesn't have basic planes, does it? No, it doesn't. <laughs> uh, yeah, it does not play basic planes. So I guess ghost quarter works. Because uh, crop rotting for a Sejuri step also works. Okay, so it's basically whether we want to play around Plow or uh, Assassin's Trophy. Yeah. What do you, what do you think he is like? What did he pitch? A punishing bar? Uh, so there's two unknowns. What, 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 do you, what do you think he has? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> So this deck usually works. Uh, if you GQ, if you Ghost Quarter the Savannah, they play Basic Forest, so they can still cast the Assassin's Trophy. Yeah. Or actually, we can float Black Black. Or no. Oh, we can't play around both. You got to choose what you lose to. Exactly. Well, I think at this point, I think I think I think it's well. I think we're more likely yeah. to um, be able to rebuild with Crop if he blows us out with Trophy. We just get yeah. one additional. Yeah, it's, so I yeah. That's, I think that's the choice. Feature trophy, feature trophy. Because like he fetched for specifically for white mana, which me, makes me feel like he more likely has plow. <laughs> oh, he's bluffing it hard. Does he have plow? He doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> Bluffed it hard. So well now yeah, we've officially no. now we've officially punted the match. So if we don't win uh, our third game. Yeah, no the the white yeah, the white the white makes it more likely he has the he has the plow. <laughs> Cause he went out of his way to fetch white. Yeah, but that was possible he was just trying to cycle into a specific that gave him both outs. So if he's trying to cycle into either a plow or a trophy, that gives him both. That's but, fair enough. Looks, I like this hand. It's alright. I think it's not a. No, it's not a mulligan because we have we have path to the combo. We have a knight of the reliquary answer or chalice answer, and we have a turn one discard spell. Assuming we don't get chaliced, so yeah, I don't think we can send this back. Do you think he even keeps Chalice in? I don't know. I think on the play he does. If he's bringing in Plows, that's certainly not a... Uh, that's true. Combination. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how far it I just assume they have both.
every time this happens, I'm both happy and sad. Happy that that didn't that card didn't get a Knight of the Reliquary, and sad that they accelerated. I'm I'm usually terrified of the three mana, three mana, like just the scary number. <laughs> wow. Oh, that's hope. Well, that's a lot, I guess. Ow. Uh, well, I gave our Urborg helps him. I just gave him the mana to cast I Liliana, too. I think we take Bob. Yeah, how do we actually beat Assassin's Trophy? Uh, hope he discards it to Liliana. I don't think he's gonna do that. <laughs> Uh, we can. I mean, we aren't beating the Bob if it comes down plus Liliana, are we? Because we, we're, we're gonna need to kill well, both. Well, we can we can just assassin's trophy the Bob next turn. I guess you can take trophy and hope nothing bad happens. So if we take trophy and he plays Liliana, that's fine. It means he's either drawing, discarding Bob or whatever he drew for the turn. So I don't care about that at all. Um, plus, yeah, we're, I... plus we're not going the X Mage route. That, um, Right yeah, taking trophies reason. Right now we can't beat this card. Yeah, take the trophy. We're gonna draw a discard next turn. I feel it. I mean, if we draw a discard next turn, so be it. Which wouldn't be bad either, because we could take the remainder, whichever card he didn't. But I'm guessing he's gonna play Bob here. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, Bob. God Bob seems it. like this. Yeah, that's a really good Bob draw seems by like. Him. Oh, that's a wasteland. Ow. That's rough. That's real rough. Yeah, that's a wasteland. Uh, I still think we have uh, to get this. Yeah, we have to trophy the comp. I mean, we aren't winning if... No. Oh well. <laughs> oh well. So what does he do next turn? Play Liliana, play Taiga, Liliana, take off, pitch another uh, land or something? Depends on what he draws. The Taiga might get chucked if uh, the other card he drew is any good. Which is what appears to be happening here. Yeah, I'm on a very slight delay, so it's like, okay. sometimes I don't see it. So yeah. here I think the discard versus a Lilia an onboard Liliana is probably Sylvan Safekeeper. Yeah, pitch, pitch the Safekeeper. <laughs> Safe Cooper seems fine. Oh, he chopped it. That's pretty good. Oh, that's a good draw. Use the Urborg? Uh, yeah. Let's see if he wants to blow his wasteland or not. I mean, if he blows it, we just name Liliana. Yeah. <coughs> do we just scrying here? I believe we do, yeah. Just scrying for death. It's possibly and then Drew try to go off it. Yeah, it's possibly Drew Decay, but we'll see. Uh, I can't play around it. As long as he doesn't use it immediately and wasteland us immediately, we can play around it. Yeah. Man, that wasteland was a really good draw. Luckily, he does not have white mana yet. So any knight off the top or card like that is not a problem at the moment. Same with Plow. Here it's Crop Rot, right? Yep. I mean, we have two. Golgari Charm. <laughs> Gotta be Sylvan Safe I mean, Gotta be Sylvan Safe Yeah, I suppose that's true. I mean, right, that, that, so, that is, they, they need to bring it in. So okay. we're more or less priced into going for it next turn, no matter what, because of Liliana's gonna ultimate the turn after. Oh, yep. No, oh, I guess it's still okay. I would have preferred yep. this been in the deck instead of having to use the ghost quarter if necessary, but they don't, they don't they only play one basic. Is it only one basic? Okay. Yeah. They don't play they don't play swamp. Or some people were playing swamp, but I think the standard list don't play swamp. Okay. Oh, so this is actually an interesting call. I guess we just chuck wasteland, right? Yeah, you chuck wasteland. I think that yeah, we, it has to be this turn, because we can't beat Liliana doing its thing. Yeah, uh, we're not beating the ult. Or, we guys... Alright, um... So he doesn't have white. Interesting. We go for it. We can't beat Trophy. Yeah. <laughs> I, agree. I mean... Well, no, we can't. We're one land short. Like... 
Like, how do we be trophy? You actually just can't be trophy. Or do we be decay? We we do be decay. Yeah. Sweet. Sweet. Neat. So as bad as that, um. So we basically won three games if we didn't find game one. Yeah. <laughs> basically. Yeah, that was. Uh... To be fair, though, we got a the middle game on a play that we wouldn't have had on the play. So that may or may not have mattered. And we don't necessarily know what they're uh, due to the shame scoop. They did have a draw step that we didn't give them. So he may have drawn it out. This player is very good, too. Ah, uh, it's Lawyer, or somebody who doesn't know how to spell Lawyer. Lawyer, Brazilian, Brazilian player that uh, Arkin's arch nemesis. Uh, yeah, I actually can't beat You can't beat him either? <laughs> yeah. He's always he's always had it. He's always had turn one ancient tomb. That'll kill you. Show and tell. <laughs> he was playing on Tezzerate or Brew last time I played him. A Tezzerate or Brew? Well, that's pretty bad. Um, I mean, I think we thought he's here. And then... Yeah, it's just a beating if there's a... a... A difference between whether I wanna. I think I wanna. You probably I thought Zs and see what's going on, and then see yeah, yeah. I was, I was more debating whether I wanted to play the Bayou or thin the deck a little bit, but I don't know what deck he's on. So, we'll, and we kind of want more lands at the moment. He's on our deck. Well, he's on your deck, I should say more specifically. Oh. So. Uh, I guess it's probably it's... Hex Mage. Yeah, it's a full turn faster with Hex Mage. <laughs> Yeah, it's hex mage. Do you just play the diamond? I believe so. Yeah. Yeah, like he might just. Some people are pretty trigger happy when it comes to wasteland. Uh yeah. If he does it, he does it. Um, I'm actually kind of okay with that. Um, we're obviously gonna need to draw lands if he does, but I I, I like protecting the map from decay because this version runs like three or four decay main deck, right? Yes, three so. decay standard. Yeah, so I like uh, playing around. Oh, he's, with, uh, uh, he's holding up. He's bluffing crop rot. Or trying to. Uh, nope. Yeah, so that's pretty sweet. So. Do we scrying here to protect ourselves from discard spells? So it's scrying to protect from discard spells or. Well, this deck, must think... run, this deck could run him too. Or leave, think, up, leave up map to play around Decay. Those are the two options. I think there, there are more discard spells than there are Decays on the deck. Um, true. There are, there, are, there, are, there are 10 discard spells. Well, there's him, too. So Yeah, so I'm including decay, that. It's so decay seven, and him. seven, eight, nine. Yeah, it's Decay and him versus... Um, <laughs> uh, I think I like, I think I like yeah. just holding this up. Because if they play a discard spell, we can crop rot, right? Um, yeah. And end map. Yeah, like if they hymnotorak, they hymnotorak. Not much, not too much even about it. I don't think their hand was very good. <laughs> I mean, like, in the is... dark, in the dark, they had a wasteland. Yeah. In both versions of the full combo. Yeah, that like the hand um, in the the hand in the dark on the draw in the dark is. This deck doesn't uh, run Caracas main, does it? Uh, I've come across it, but I don't. That's incredibly ballsy. The play he just made. The library. Look, we know his whole hand. This was this came off the top. Oh. Uh, so. Neat. No, he is one unknown. So unless he has multiple, like unless, no, he, drew, he's, unless he's, he drew a hex, he's one unknown. Yeah, because he played this. So unless he drew exactly a hex mage to combo next turn, how does he beat us? Just. Going. Do we just do we just map? Yeah, I think we just map Shadowland game, right? Yeah, I mean he has a wasteland in hand that we can now beat on board because of the way he played it. So I don't. Yeah, it's, it was interesting. I mean, because yeah. if he if he taps out to play Hex Mage Depths next turn, we still just straight up win because we have the scrying. Yeah, we, we make it um, main phase. No, now we don't even need oh, to. Oh, uh... wow, wow. I'm go oh, I'm so <laughs> good at this drawing right. Sigiri step. Now we're protected against discard, too. Unless, of course, so unless of course yes. he uh, does have Caracas main deck, at which point. We were dead anyways. The tears <laughs> well. 
It's 3 a.m. for Jax, and he's still watching. That's dedication. Wow. I don't. Isn't it like 3 a.m. for like Arkin too? But he's streaming. Arkin is never not streaming. I don't get like. Up. I don't get up or get home from work or do anything without seeing him streaming. He's no, like like like, like, like he's like he's streaming, but it's like U.S. times, and I'm just wondering, don't you live in the Czech Republic? Uh, yes. So isn't his time like? Something absurd. <laughs> Do you like someone safe people in the mirror? I don't. I don't even. You don't like it? Yeah. I think it's just an mirror. extra layer of insulation against their Caracas, and I guess like when, I, when I'm playing the, mirror, I always... it's just not a good card. Oh. Do you do not keep it to beat life in the lab? Or do you just say whatever? Oh, I clicked on the wrong card. That was a mistake. The Bajuka Bog, yeah. You don't board out depths? <laughs> Sometimes I do. My deck is uh, not the same as yours. I mean, the mirror is grindier, but um, I'm not trying to outgrind them forever. I'm trying to combo a little bit more than you are. That's fair enough. Yikes. Uh... I think this is probably okay. There's a uh, I think that's a keep. There's a non-zero chance they play Urborg for us. Which yeah, would be amazing. I, I can bring. I think it's a. I, I think. I think. I think it's a keep. It's a little soft because if they discard us here, see our hand, and decide to randomly wasteland our colored source, that could be a problem. Guessing they just take Inquisition here. Maybe Brainstorm. <laughs> that was pretty bad. Uh, I... What's that? Second Hex Mage is a bad. Yes, this was a terrible draw. I mean, maybe it gets so bad where stuff gets needled or destroyed. I, I've seen uh, I, I, that, that I, I've had some attacking, pretty bad draws. What's that? I, I've had some pretty bad draws with this deck where I, I've drawn quad hex mage off the top in a row before. That that was the worst. <laughs> with no no double black, it was the worst. Well, there's the wasteland. Hmm. I think you take the draw set. Yikes. Uh, here I think we brainstorm as opposed to scrying. Brain. Um, what do we try to hit here? Fetch land? Yeah, anything to fix this hand. Um, maybe a land in this card. I mean, maybe scrying for herb works better, but... Mm -hmm. I don't know. Urborg is pretty detrimental in the mirror. Yeah, I don't like the idea of setting him up for an easy kill next turn. Alright, that's pretty good. That's a solid... We can throw one of those hex mages back. <laughs> yeah. Do we put the needle on top? Or we cast the needle this turn? I was thinking about needling this turn, but maybe that's wrong. <laughs> This next turn we can put needle we can go put needle on top, draw needle, play needle, sylvan shrine, or we can needle this turn. What do you name Wasteland? Yeah, if he lets it go, but odds are he would not let it go. Hmm. This is interesting. I think we have to put a card on top that we're willing to lose. 
Like, I'm, I'm pretty sure he has an abrupt decay or a crop rotation in his hand because he took the Inquisition. Okay, that's fair. Yeah, like otherwise, I think if you don't, if your hand is kind of shitty playing slow deaths, you don't really care about what discard spells. Okay. Yeah. So well, right now, I think I'm gonna just. He, uh, he yeah. very likely has crop rot or abrupt decay or something. I don't know. Or at least that's what I would do. I would take. Okay, if we don't see a Bob this turn, I'm gonna shuffle away the. Um... Wow. Oh. Oh, thanks. Uh, that was. So would you shuffle away the decay? I put that on top to give the option. I don't think they have Bob, or we would have seen it right here. Um. I guess. I think we I, also I, would have seen a needle by now. I think we shuffle. Yeah. yeah. Are you upkeep shuffle. Oh, we should know that we do the hex mage again. Yeah. I mean, there's always a chance where you can go down the beat down play. <laughs> I've won. I've, I've won a lot of mirrors off the beat down plan, so. Hmm. What do we? What do you? What do you name with the middle now? I actually think it's Caracas now, and then just um, if we can force him to, we could just play Depths, cast Hex Mage, and we can force him to crop rot his other green source away to wasteland us if he has it. Oh, well, he can crop rot the Arborg. That's true too, but we have Which, we're okay on colored mana at the moment. Yeah. So I think we cut off Caracas. No. Yeah. Are you gonna make it on upkeep? That's the plan. This is why you don't play Herbwork Voice. <laughs> well, he may still he may still have it. So the other thing we could do is wait, and then we have stage next turn. Uh, too. you lose the wasteland off like natural wasteland though. Sure. Uh, this this line loses to crop rotation only. I believe that's accurate. So like instead of dying to a seven outer or a six outer, you die to just. I guess it also oh. I guess it also dies to decay plus. Um, Caracas. Yeah, or decay plus land crop rot, but. You didn't oh, have oh, he's dead. Well, right. we did it. Well, I'm <laughs> we, yeah. we did it. Since that was only um, an actual three matches, you want to keep going for a bit? Oh, yeah, keep going. It's fine. It's only it's only six o'clock here. Nice. Yeah, I think that that would have been an easy five zero if um, if we were on the play versus Rug Delver. Yeah, I mean that's what Rug Delver does, though. So. Yeah, when Rug when when Rugged Over is good, Rugged Over does does its thing, and then we feel real bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, our draws were um, uh, less than ideal too. I think we had a shot um, in one of the two. I mean, the first game they just they just trucked us with turn one Delver Flex and two Tarn Wave, uh, double Wasteland and some Counter Magic. Um, but the other game we lost, we had. He he had double we, stifle, double days. Sure, but I mean, our we, hand our hand was um, garbage. Double mox, garbage mulligan into double mox, minor garbage, and um, yeah, that was just unlucky. Did you redo? What are the chances? <laughs> this hand is what uh, are the ch this hand is awful. The I've kept the hand like this, but I probably will again. <laughs> in the dark? I mean, maybe if I knew what this person was on. Well, but what if he's is... playing Sneak and Show? <laughs> Minotaur, Reg sorry. Right? What, what, what deck is the five-colored source hand good against? So it's a turn Lions, four no. turn four combo of five-colored sources. So I don't think that's uh, even... This hand's actually worse. 
Um, uh, it, it's a mulligan. It's a mulligan for sure. Oh, this hand looks. Oh. I mean, we're on the play too. Let's go to five. Yeah. You're already on five. So. The diamonds are five. You're already on five. This is also bad, but. Uh, we're just gonna have I've to kept, live with it. I've kept the hand like this, except with like less less color. Uh, oh, is that a keep? It's a. Um, uh, <laughs> is, mean... is that a? <laughs> I mean, we could we to actually have this actually matter. We have to discard depths, and then have, I think so. We would I have to resolve this and this through everything. It loses the days. It loses the force. Loses to everything. For that so to you actually bottom that there. So I think we bottom and hope to draw an actual land. Uh, if you, if you believe hard enough, that's how hard will be our work. It's possible. <laughs> I've, I've I've learned I've learned that. I don't think, if you believe hard enough. I actually don't think that's the play. I don't think we can play depths first here though. I think we have to play stage first. No, if you we draw play stage land, and hope we just simply sign. Yeah, we have to try and draw a land. Um, he bottom. He, he bottom. So it's like. I mean. I mean, it feels bad. What if he's board off the top, but. I mean, yeah. what if he's playing actual like sneak and chill with did your, Oh, is that a draw step trigger? Is he playing Miracle? Uh, Goblin. No, that's human. Goblin. Goblin. <laughs> oh, this is lackey. <laughs> well, if I knew they were on Goblins, I would have kept the Mox Diamond on top. All right, Urborg. One time. <laughs> that's the opposite of Urborg. Ow, we didn't we didn't believe hard enough. Well, if we kept the Mox, <laughs> if we kept the Mox Diamond. We would have. I worked. mean, if he has wasteland, wasteland stage, and we don't draw a board, we die. <laughs> well, he may just wasteland here. Which is I mean, sweet. the smart the smart play is to hit this. Oh, perfect. I mean, he oh, has a free cool. goblin maker in play. We're probably going to get run over here. Uh, let's just hope his ring leaders draw one card. Let's see putting it. That's a good one. Oh, whatever. It's just a lord. We're fine. We'll draw. We'll draw. We'll draw green. Just a three-three lord. Oh, okay. We, we may we die without dead. ever playing a spell this game. Yeah, I had a game. I had a game against Bird over similar like this, but instead I drew. Uh, I I kept. It was a one lander at the stage. Oh, now we're, oh, now, now, we're, we're we're, now we're really on Urborg or bust. Urborg. <laughs> Yeah, I was I was playing versus Bruid Dover and I kept the hand like this, but without the depths and just the stage, and I had a bunch of hex mages, and I scried top depths and I drew Urborg after. <laughs> that was uh gotta believe. <laughs> That's a <laughs> uh yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I can't play Deaths without Velocity Jury Step in my hand. Oh, that's one way to lose to Goblins. Ow. That was sad. That was, uh... Do we have anything worth dressing other than Vile? I don't think so, right? No, you take out Duress. They play... Nah, they, they have nothing. Uh, yeah. Doris is trash. Safekeeper blocks a goblin lackey, but that's pretty much it. Yeah, I'm not putting it. Oh, no, Safekeeper actually shuts off the um, Sting Scourger, too. But I'm not bringing, uh, I'm not bringing whatever. it for that. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, Goblins is such a favorable matchup anyways. I don't think even more. Yeah, well. It's, it's, it's favorable until we draw a death's death stage. <laughs> Every matchup's losable when you never cast a spell. It's it's like that time I lost. It's like it's like losing a burn. It feels, yeah. Looking at all their devastating red cards, trying to figure out which ones come in. Um, I expect Blood Moon if they're playing it. Sounds about right. I don't think they have anything else, just like Blood Moon, that's it. 
a second coffee stink surger. Yeah, maybe. Maybe a spicy uh, chaos warp or something like that. Nah, they don't play that stuff. Um, that looks like a keep. It has no way to no way to find depths. That's true. And you can't grind as well as slow depths can. Uh, I mean, you're basically on a six with the mox that in. Do you go down a six? I'm thinking about it. I just don't like the idea that if we don't find a depth in the first three or four turns, we're probably going to lose. Yeah, um, just chip at them. I mean, we have high the needle for wasteland, so they don't Jesus. really have interaction. Oh, that's even worse. It is worse, but I think I'm going to keep this. I don't want to go to five and not be able to cast anything. Yeah, you just go Urborg and hope he wastes yeah. yeah. Hexmage is Hexmage is very strong against uh, Goblin. It's a two, 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 one first striker. Yeah, maybe he wastelands this. Um, if he doesn't, even yeah. if he has a turn one lackey, we have an answer to the turn one lackey, so we can slow them a little bit. Yeah, this like isn't... like some like some Goblin players like I don't know. I I hang out on the Goblins as part a bunch, but sometimes the matchup is so bad. Sometimes you just wasteland your first land. And just hope that gets there, because like Devs has issue on colors. And we might really need this Urborg. That looks like a turn one lackey or vial. Alright. Turn one vial, less scary. <laughs> oh. oh. So. Just. So. Run out the undergrounds. Yeah, in case, yeah, in case he hits the color, hits our colored. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you, you gotta you gotta watch out for chain roller. So uh, yeah, don't don't, don't want to put too many of those out. Yeah, worst case scenario, if he does that, we'll set his vial back again. A turn. Yeah, I really don't want trophy this unless I have to when we have double hex mage. Yeah, so we can't. We currently cannot beat a lot of things. <laughs> Yeah, we're okay, because we have the green source trophy, so there's not too much he can do this turn that would bother. So we need, like, a land tutor? Yeah, any land tutor. Yep. I don't know, maybe it's worth risking putting the trop in front of a wasteland, because if we draw scrying, like it's so going to be annoying, yeah. Yeah, you play four scrying too, so... I'm on three scrying. Oh, whatever, close enough. <laughs> I'm on one, so... <laughs> I'm about to go to four. Uh, I guess that doesn't matter. Oh, whatever. We have Hexmage. It doesn't matter. Chalice doesn't really matter. Chain Whirler is a four drop, right? Three drop. Is it a three drop? Oh, it's red, red, yeah. red. Oh. <laughs> so... My, my, my powers are reaching you. It's a jury step. Step in seven. <laughs> I mean, this is the eighth card. <laughs> so. So. I don't think. Oh, I, I don't actually think, think you should attack there. Yeah, I mean, I was thinking I was going to play the second X Mage, but then I can't play around Blood Moon. Yeah, I think I'm going to do it anyway. I don't, think, I don't think he's going to. Um... We got wrecked. We got wrecked, right? Yeah. If he plays Blood Moon into an answer to his chalice plus a crop rotation death, more power to him. Or he goes like, or he goes like Goblin Lackey into um, Chain Whirler. That would be really bad. No, that didn't happen. Chain Whirler is like a one of, right? Yeah, it's one or two of. The card is really good. Well, if he has it, we're in trouble. Alright, he has it next turn. <laughs> oh. Worse. My body. Yeah, my body's probably. not ready. He probably gets sting. <laughs> they probably get sting scourger here, right? Yeah. Uh, I mean, it depends on their hand. Like, they have a wasteland in their hand, and they just, or they draw a wasteland or something. Getting a chain roller is better. Man. <laughs> The life of drawing Sejiri Step every game. 
Yeah, I think they got. I think they they're priced into getting Sting Scourger down here to not lose the crop rotation, especially with a vial. Yeah, no, they took Dick Sting Scourger. I'd be shocked if they didn't. Like, if they if they pick Chain Whirler or something, like they already have the Sting Scourger and we were fucked anyways. No, we still have right. the answer. We still have the text mage for a while. If we yeah. draw the depths or a scrying to not have to pop the Mog War Marshal. What? That is not what I expected them to get. That's uh I mean that doesn't really even attack profitably at the moment. That's a that's an odd pick. Maybe he already has everything. And we're just like Oh that sucks. What sucks? No, oh, no, shit. no, no, don't cast the chalice. No, no, no. Oh, I thought that. I'm in my mind. I'm thinking we already got rid of the chalice. Oh, no. Oh, streaming is heard. Yep. All right. Now, is this where we shame scoop? No. <laughs> no, that was god awful, though. Uh, well. That's at least two oh. unbelievably bad punts. All right. That's punt count. That's punt count, too. Is there a punt? Is there a bot on your on your train? I don't know if there is or not. I haven't tried. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. I haven't tried to set anything up in the chat. Oh, I added punt. It worked. There you go. Oh, the hack bird got it. <laughs> oh. mm. Yeah, that was pretty much. Perfect too. Yeah, I think he already has things started. Right? He's leaving it on two. Like he has to have it. I mean, that's fine. This is we, we still have that beat by waiting a turn. Is this chain roller? Uh oh. No. Huh. Huh. Then he doesn't know. Map our hexmage has first strike. That would be helpful. Then we'd be relatively even on. Uh... Yeah, I've it. seen it happen. He's, he's figured it out. <laughs> If you saw the line, like I've had people run into Hexman not knowing it. Uh, uh, don't run that snipe full into the chalice. <laughs> yeah, we already learned that one time. I mean, we'd be in great shape here had I not um, thrown that map away. <laughs> we'd have the combo in play plus trophy and stifle up right now. All right, we're um. He might be no pilot driver doesn't work because of the hex mages. I'm kind of, I'm just wondering what he took. Why did he take Mog War Marshal over like Chain Roller or any other goblin? Like maybe his jump bombing standard or something. That's possible, but what is? I mean, that's not even that great, right? Yeah, because like jump bomb already kills hex mage with just the matron. Um. Yeah, I guess there's not a particularly good reason to be sandbagging this that I can think of. I mean, if we, there's a, I guess there's a world where we somehow brain, draw brainstorm, take the counter off the chalice, brainstorm this back, um, and uh, have a yeah. crop rot for it for a sting scourger. But yeah, I don't think that's likely to come up. So we probably should have played this. Yeah, maybe it draws a wasteland or whatever. We got, we got, we got fucked. Like, the only card that's really relevant here is Chain Whirler, I think. I'm still, like, I'm still baffled by this War Marshal. Oh, yeah. There's a, a lot. <laughs> so. No, there's a cavern. There's a, there's a cavern. Cavern. Okay. I was like, oh, did he did he also make a punt? But nah, it was all according to plan. Yeah, his deck works well. I mean, Wrath Goblin. Stronghold. Well, now he's got, he can go wide with <laughs> War Marshal. Oh, please let him put that on top. <laughs> I mean, that's how he goes around. That's how he gets around the hex mage, right? Uh, go I, super wide. Yeah, uh, I, I mean, I guess I guess it's gonna get to a point that we're a lord's really yeah, going to be a problem. Yeah. Is he swing with the Kuro? There's no way he swings with the Kuro. He's still on. Well, he's thinking about it. I. There's no way. Wow. Did he swing with a curve? He swung with everything, so we're just blocking these two in the middle, right? 
We just block, right? Yeah, block the, the, the lackey and the war chief, right? There's no two mana lord. Yeah, I mean, even if even if he tries to blow us out with a vile in creature of some kind, it's, it's still stifle. Yeah. What is our opponent doing? I don't know. Oh, maybe so. Oh, maybe try to airwig swat us. That would be really bad. We would have to pop the chalice and stifle that, right? So. I'm psychic. So we can exile three depths. Yeah. So, uh, it's also a 5-3. I mean, we can kill it. We, well, yeah, we can, but it feels real bad. We can he, he has the Sting Surger. Like, I'm pretty sure he has Sting Surger, because there's no way you don't tutor it. Also, if we kill the Eric Squad, he just buys it back with the Bora Stronghold and we get fucked anyways. Right? Uh, yeah, the second time through, it's that, yeah. Hmm. Like, do we just let it happen? Let him take three deaths and try to draw one more? Or one of the last eight tutors, yeah. It does reduce our outs from eleven or from eleven to eight, yeah. Is this is this how we lose the goblins on stream? It's entirely possible. Remember how you're like off oh, thirteen and one on stream with bug yeah, deaths. So we can't so we can't really kill this ever. No. Uh, it's gonna start recurring. I think I think we can if we if we draw a combo piece, because that way it requires him three turn, uh, two turns to get this thing online again. Yeah. All right, plus, guess. plus he loses a bunch of guys to uh, the hex mages, anyways. I guess we let so him I think we, I, I think you let him take it, see what he takes. Like he might just take like Sylvan Scryings or something. Like he's probably taking three depths, but like it's probably not good enough. And I'm also pretty sure he has things for in his hand already. That's why he didn't tutor for it. Like, the Mog War Marshal play makes sense because the Pile Driver is useless. Sting Surger, you already have it in your hand. But, like, I think Chain Roller is still the better, better, better take. What did you take? Three depths. All right, let's draw with the last one. Can we get lucky? We did not get lucky. Yeah, if you're, if you're gonna play the Mox, do it now then, right? No? No, I can play. Yeah, I mean, I could just discard it too. But yeah, it, yeah, it probably needed to go down. Uh, okay. Yeah, he's he's leaving the vial on two for Sim Trigger. Yeah. Uh, we have that covered several different ways, so we're not worried about this. I'm worried about actually finding a card that does something. Now that we threw away the first one. Yep. We should go. I think we just take this for now. We just take the five, yeah. Not have to deal with it. I'm kinda surprised he's not swinging the Goblin Matron. Because Matron's just free value. Chain Whirler? No? Not with a black. Another one? Z has two, two oh, Eerie squads? Good. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that, was gonna be a, that was gonna be bad. Oh, it's just War Chief. Whatever. Whatever. Alright. What do we get? Oh, there it is. The last one. We did it. <laughs> oh, I did it. Uh. <laughs> So we just gotta bank. We just gotta hope he doesn't draw wasteland. No, we have wasteland beat too. Yeah, we yeah we be wasteland. So we just gotta not die this turn. Yes. Yeah. We drew our we drew our one deaths. We did it. <laughs> it looks worse that way when we drew this, but there was basically eight copies of it left. Yeah, yeah. Especially after we threw away the, the, the expedition map. Yeah, that was incredibly bad. This board wasn't nearly as complicated as the mistake we made against Dan. 
that was at least oh there yeah no, there was at least more going on than this i feel like no dan, dan had like five like five five ways to kill our shit well that's the thing that's what i'm saying like yeah we had um uh one two then we blocked the the the, the two two and the one one i believe so yeah I don't know if there's any way. You think they run Goblin Grenade? That would no. Be... <laughs> uh, <laughs> Trying to think of a way it, they could do five to our face. Uh, they, they don't even. They can't even. Work. Don't don't block the matron. Don't block the matron. Why not? Uh, I, I don't know. There's random shenanigans. I would just block a token. Well, what do you mean? As far as I mean, they can't use well, this. They would have to draw a card for this to be relevant. I mean, gem palm is a thing. I don't know. I, I think there's just no reason to take that risk. You just block a token and just, you know. All right. Yeah, just block a block a token and the war chief. Like it's unnecessary. It's just unnecessary to to risk anything because we have everything covered. How do I do five? What's that? How do I do a five? <laughs> That's the real question. I don't know. So let's see. All right, no wasteland. So, so do we just straight up trophy the vial first? I think we go for the no. I think we uh, go to end step. Yeah, I'm saying during the end step, do we just trophy the vial first? No, we can we can just text match the vial. Uh, yeah, but then we can't shut off Chalice if we need Stifle for some unknown reason. We can trophy the Chalice. Uh, that is also true. So you think we I just, think we go for so that. You think we just I think we go for, go for it. I think we go for it and put him to the test and make him. I think you just. And then we can just file. Uh, I mean, hex mage the file. Because what what do I do? Removal spell? Wait, did they die? Volk edict. Uh, that's a good question. I, I think if we hex mage the depths and he goes vile, we can ch trophy the chalice and then stifle the, the sting surger. And that way we still we, we still beat um, Diabolic if he's playing it. I like that. That that seems that seems that seems like an optimal line. <laughs> like the other way loses the diabolic edict, but we it does the same thing. Like, it feels like Gem Palm plus di plus Diabolic Edict, we weren't winning any. We and Sting Surger, we weren't gonna win any. <laughs> That's fair. So like, if he had three things, you got me. <laughs> like, a trophying vial takes the takes the Sting Surger off the table. He either has to put it in immediately. So you can try. I, mean, uh, I guess we can try that with the yeah. Try that with the with this on the stack. Uh, I guess. I don't know. Whatever. Don't play, we don't we don't have to play on edict. I don't think that. I, mean, I think it's too late. I don't... At this point anyway, because he could sting Scourger the second hex mage if he has Scourger plus edict. Yeah. So I don't. Think uh, it's so. I think we go with the line I was saying. Yeah. So we're letting this happen. Yeah. Yep. Cool. Uh, trophy. I, think, I still think he should have suited freaking Chain Whirler. The Stifle. That should do it. So he needs exactly weirding or edict plus. No, plus weirding is sort of. 
We're doing a sorcery. Is this sorcery? Okay, so we needed actual diabolic edict to end a Yeah, well. like I don't know, man. I don't think anything the changes here unless we want to bring in safekeeper as an additional <laughs> lackey answer. On the draw, do you care about do you, do we care about we we do care about lackey. A little bit, yeah. We need a diamond to be able to answer it on the draw. It's such a okay. what's it better than, I guess, is the question. He's playing Chalice of the Void, so. Yeah, that's a good call. Do we take out the Brainstorm then? Yeah, I hate Brainstorm against Chalice sticks. Stifle's not very good either against Chalice, but obviously oh. it matters in certain spots. Hi. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dude, that's the jury step. I actually think this hand is on the draw is actually moderately playable because we can cash this into the depths, assuming we don't get chaliced. Because we're gonna get this, we're gonna get to discard them twice, so we should be able to stop so. chalice. Lackey's gonna be a problem, but if he has it. He has I it. I think this is okay. And he kept the seven, so he probably has. Turn one lackey or turn one vile. Please be vile. Yeah. Nope. No. That, that's unfortunate. So here I actually. Thought think it might be better for Thoughtseize, yeah. You have Thoughtseize and hope for the best. I believe so. Or Bark? Ugh. Or Bark? Ugh. 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 <laughs> Oof. So. Our hand actually, sucks. We could actually stifle the lackey trigger the first trip. Do you want to do that? Yeah, it's it's pretty iffy. Cause what? Yeah. It's a pretty big waste of resources. Yeah, I'm not a fan of that. I mean, hope this hand is trash. This hand is. Oh yeah, his hand's, his hand's mediocre. Uh, yeah, That's for but sure. He's going to straight up wasteland our only colored source. <sighs> Just hope he doesn't. Some people are scared. I mean, this hand does nothing else besides that, so unless he drew a relevant. I card. mean, some people are scared. Some people are just very unwilling to, to do that. Oh, really I mean, he puts. Deal. Oh, Why that's a yike. Not play Wait. a land. He just forgot to play a land. Wow. We're oh. Oh, that's a. Wait, we can't kill him. Uh, we can't kill him, no. Do we just put a hex? Uh, we don't play it. Uh, the, the Critter Maker can pull up a diamond. Uh, they can kill everything, though. I think we just play Hex Mage and make him kill the diamond. Or kill, make him kill the Hex Mage. But then how do we win from there? That's true. So we just hold up the Stifle? I believe so. We can Stifle this, and if he tries to Wasteland it, we can Drop Rot protect it, too. Yeah, seems fine. Like, he doesn't have anything to put in Lackey anymore, so Lackey's not actually that scary. Let's see what he wants to do. Like, Lackey's, like, Lackey's actually quite bad. I also don't really want to give him a target for the Incinerator, either. Alright, so he just went for that, which is sweet. Alright, now he might just play send us, because we missed the land drop. Well, that's that would be I, I would be ideal. Do we do we go for depths or do we just try to? I think we go for. Oh, what is that? A different is that is that? Oh, I thought it was the end of my turn. I just straight up must have F six turn. Oh. upkeep. this is going really well. All right. Well. Uh, all right. Let me go put another pun counter. <laughs> that was definitely a punt. Oh, that one blocks. Oh, I know. He is jump bomb. <laughs> he is jump bomb. I think we just inquisition here and just like take the jump bomb. That sounds fair. I can't cycle it. Wow. Oh, that's a Polrath stronghold. I mean, it's not active yet. This is a. This is a series of unfortunate events. Yeah, I have to learn how to uh, not be pressing buttons like that. Cause... How to play? How to play on stream? <laughs> well, we we said the line out loud, and then I just hit a button that I shouldn't have. So. Oh, 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 that's bad. Oh, goodbye, diamond. We're dead. 
He just drew. Alright. Alright, we're dead. That's not a start, but sure. Alright. Our out here is Urborg. Urborg is our out? Urborg wins us the game? Right, we can go hex mage, untap, crop rot. Oh wait, you don't have you don't you don't have basic forest. Never I mind. Do not have basic forest. No. Never mind. We are dead. Oh, he has a thing. Which one? Chain whirling boy. Oh. Ow. This is uh This is a beating. Uh this should not have been a beating. <laughs> his his lackey was going to get trophied after we untapped after saving our land with crop rotation. And... Alright, we're dead. T he's getting a race squad. Yeah, hey, there it is. So Did we Did we draw Whoa, five. 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 we don't five. So we're not Hi, six. Straight, we're not straight dead, right? So we need to decide. Are you rotating for death for for Urborg? So we can either do that or wait to see what we draw next turn. I think we we played the hex mage and try to block the something and try to take less damage because we we're gonna eight and then the next turn eight five yeah no no so if we draw perfects we can block. We can hold off the matron. They'll we don't they don't have lethal next that turn after. Sure, we don't, we don't have a green source that way is the problem. I mean, it looks like we're dead. So we're not exactly dead. So they can hit us for five, right? The earwake squad comes in and strips three depths out. So so, so we go to five. We can, gonna... If we can combo next turn, he has three bodies. He still has. He does not have he lethal. For, he can hit us for five twice, right? Five next yeah. turn, five the turn after. Well, we, we, we have to fetch, so it's lethal. Oh, no, you're right. That's exact. All right. Uh, no, we, we, we have to play Hex Mage this turn. We need to save the three life. We need to save the two damage. Uh, we could play Safekeeper this turn. What does that do, though? That blocks and gives us the option to draw either Urborg or Depths next turn. I guess if you play Safekeeper, you block the Trash Master, draw Urborg. Draw to Urborg win. or Depths. Draw Urborg or Depths. And then Crop Rock. All right. On. That's eight outs versus um versus four, right? Yeah, go for it. I think Safekeeper block Trash Master is probably the line then. Especially when he's going to take three Depths um, away from us. Yeah. Yeah, we're very unlikely. Yeah, I would rather have yeah, no. this five outs. Oh, if only, if only you had that basic forest. <laughs> uh, does that actually do anything in this spot? I don't know. I think if we drew Urbrug this turn, it would have mattered. <laughs> we did not draw our fork this turn. <laughs> I feel like a lot of these games are. Maybe we, did we draw Urbrug? Yeah. Well, our, our opener was pretty weak, and then I punted on top of that, or we would have been fine. We would have beaten this setup easily with the extra land. Just block the 3-3. Oh. Yeah, I guess do it now. I think you have to block the 3-3. You got an 8, plays the guy, 6, 8. So you take 5 next turn if, we, if we're lucky? Yeah. If This is assuming he, he just plays that thing and doesn't have a wasteland. All right. <laughs> go, go, Urborg. Come on, Urborg or Ducks. <laughs> all right, all right, we dead. We didn't, we didn't, we didn't, we didn't, we didn't. I, we feel, didn't, like, we didn't. I feel like mistakes were made. Serious mistakes were made. 
I think multiple mistakes were made. Yeah. I, I, I think the, the crop rod was the biggest one. I think that's everything else was like, all right, I guess. Oh, Mega Stone. Man, these hands of. Uh... Got some more up. That's a keep. It's not great. Loses to a stiff breeze. <laughs> hey, hey, there's the airborg. <laughs> oh, it's black red. <laughs> oh, it's black red. That's usually what bloodstone, bloodstain mire fetch means to me. Bad luck, swamp. All right, we're dead. No, well, maybe not. Maybe this is Grixis control. This is still bad. Doubt it. This is still bad because highly our, doubt it. They're taking our brainstorm hero. If he takes if he takes pie, they need to only just lose, right? Uh, oh yeah, I didn't think they were. Oh. I mean, this could be Grixis control. Yeah, this looks like Grixis. Oh, either way, I'm not, not Doris. just in case. Yeah. This is Hope oh. Tess. <laughs> oh, they played Basic Swamp? Huh. I don't know. That's new. So I guess this is uh, Plunder, right? I think you take the Plunder, right? I think so, yeah. Like, what do you lose to here? One, two, so he's. he's so one, That's two, three. Ad is natural Adnaws would uh, would do it. Does it doesn't do it? He doesn't know. <laughs> Isn't it? Isn't it? Oh, That's four. He's That's four. Short. That's... He would need to draw one more card. Yeah. All right. So our needle is super dead. Deaths. Oh, that's bad. How's that bad? Oh, that's true. It's fine. Do we just scrying here for deaths? I think hope, we, hope we, we try to cut there. their turns off. Yeah. I mean, we could have gotten wasteland and try to cut them off volcanic island but that just seems bad i think we just i think we just go for it give them their two draws and if they hit it they hit it i think we draw the crop rod we if we drew if we drew like a crop rod i think yeah going for a wasteland is fine yeah i think just minimizing their turns is the way to do it from here we can't even we can't even try to cheese them next turn with an extra pithing needle on a on a fetch land yeah no not with their board out the, Man, the, the plus side of this line is we are going to have, if we draw any one relevant, one casting cost relevant piece of interaction, we can do some yeah. crop rock. I, I don't know. Some. Yeah, I don't know. Test played swamp. I thought they just played island, or did they just play both? Um, that's a really good question. I mean, I haven't picked. Oh, much we're dead. Oh, it looks like he's going for it. What combination kills us here? Inferno Tutor. Well, he's losing one of his cards here. What? One, in two, the three. World? Uh, oh, I think he's empty egg. Well, we I think he's going for M. We beat empty the Lawrence, so this is totally fine. God, empty's awful. That's what this is. We're pretty good. Two mana. No, he's dead. He's getting Adnaz and trying to roll in. For next turn? Yeah, he, he, he's trying to he's trying to cheese it out. If we if we draw... And that's not a bad idea. <laughs> yeah, like... like So basically, is if he draws a mana source, he wins game. So... Uh, I think this is totally irrelevant, right? There's nothing we can name that matters, correct? Uh, you can name a bin and hope. <laughs> no, I don't think I'm going to do that. I mean, you can name play of the game. So he's probably that's like, also he's probably like that's also a good. borderline 50 50 to hit here right basically half the decks mana uh remember to make the Merrill age i think i would have just made main phase barrel age last here oh is that right of flame that is oh a, we're dead that was the best well not the best but that means he's gonna have a land drop post ad nausea well we're dead or barely likely to lose yep ponder Cabal Rit. Uh, he doesn't have enough. Yeah, he's good now, right? Uh, no, he's good. We're dead. I think we can... Wait, no. Do you need more mana? 
He needs he's got one. He two, needs one more ritual. Five. He needs another ritual. Yeah, he's got five. No, he's got more than that. Because he goes the land pedal five. I think he's good. Three six. I think he's good because he's got the cabal root right, too. Which... Maybe maybe he'll forget how to play magic. Maybe he maybe he just forgets the whole priority. Like the heavens. I'm gonna make him show me. He he paused enough on for life that um He might not he might not know he has enough. Or they may not have I mean I'm not a test expert. I don't know everything this deck can do, but he's he's walking through it slow enough that I don't want him to show me. Hmm. It's unfortunate. Three. Actually, he's space. So he's six he, mana. So if he cabal rates, he's stuck on black, right? So he can't actually cast. Yeah, the no, he, he can't burn English. Yeah. So he'll he, he only. So he's uh, on Inferno. He's six mana. He's six he's mana there. post the uh, Inferno Sitter. He, he doesn't have. No, he doesn't have it. He doesn't have enough. Five, four, three, six. Yeah, he, he doesn't have enough. That's the colors that are the problem. Yeah, he can't like, he doesn't have a dark red. If he had a dark red. If he had a dark red. Like, if he had a dark red or a red of flame, we were just dead. But, like, he doesn't have it. He doesn't have it. I think that's why he's he's thinking about it. Well, he still has redraws, I guess. He could um Brainstorm. Yeah, we're ponder, yeah. Brainstorm's probably a lot better though, although he's tapping black. I'm not sure what he's doing. If he if he casts anything not named Cabal Ritual, he loses, right? Well, so what can oh, he, you brainstorm? Do they have, brainstorm? Do they have past and flames in the main deck? No, Cyborg. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I was trying to think. If he gets a 6, maybe he can pass in flames, but he's... He can't. He, he, he can't. There's no way. Alright. Yeah, no, he, he he doesn't have enough. They don't they don't have pass in flames. I mean, he can, he can Burning Wish now, but he's short Storm Count. Yeah, no, he doesn't have... No, the, 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 the Cyborg. No, I'm, the saying one can, condition. I'm saying he can bring Wish for... No, for three mana? He doesn't have anything. Well, for, for three. Four, for four mana. No, he, no, he can't bring oh. Wish and Kapal Red. No, no, I know he only has one card now. I'm saying he could bring Wish, but I don't think he can do much for four mana. He can burning Wish for... Tendrils and try to not die. Yeah. But then what draw do you need next turn? That doesn't seem like a winning line to me. He can't, he can't like Burning Wish for like. Yeah. I believe he doesn't have enough. Unless he has Passing Flames. Oh, Even Passing Flames doesn't do, do anything here. Yeah, four mana is just not. Unless they, yeah, have something new. Unless they have something new in the yeah. deck that I'm not aware of. Alright, so we're getting domed. Yeah, like, I think that's his only line. I'm just not sure where this goes. With no hand. Nah, I, I, I think he's he's dead. He doesn't have... What, what can they draw? Tess literally just, like, blows its load. He doesn't even have enough to survive. He's dead. That's fine. He's still dead. He's still dead. He's just still dead. Alright, he's still exactly dead. That's that's pretty that's that's pretty funny. Alright. We managed to steal game one. Yep. So uh, I don't think surgicals are worth it against Tess. I think on the play it's fine. Because taking like Burning Wish is pretty big, because they can't actually kill you. It depends on how they play, but it's possible. Maybe I'll bring one but, in, just to get a look at their sideboard cards. It's better, it's, it's better than Bog. It's better than Bog? 
I don't, I don't play Pass and Flames. I don't I play Pass and Flames. I guess I could do it that way. Like, like Bog is so dead. I mean, they do have a Pass and Flames line out of the sideboard, though. No, they, they all cut it. Really? Like, Brian, yeah, Brian, Brian Cook and, like, the other test people. I think Brian Cook wrote an article about how test, oh, Pass and Flames isn't worth playing in the sideboard. And, you know, all of them play Brian Cook's list. Hmm. Okay. Or, or yeah. Like, I think if we get Pass and Flames, we get Pass and Flames. I don't think it's worth keeping, though. Because, okay. like, you draw Bog in your opening hand, like I always do, it, it feels real bad. I mean, it seems fine. I'm not. You don't bother with Safekeeper against their bounce spells, do you? Uh, I board out one and keep one in, but I only have, I start with two, so there's not much. I, there's not much. <laughs> Somebody have a baby where you're at? <laughs> yes, there is. I, that's why I mute it. <laughs> Test deck and a trench coat, huh? That's a lovely image. Hackward. See, I, I would be checking Twitch chat more on my phone. Oh, you're back on your phone now? No, I'm on my computer, but I'm using my phone as the mobile hunt. Okay. Wow, that's step in hand again. Yeah, this is fine though. We have a brainstorm. Unless they discard us right off the bat. Or kill us right off the bat. That's also a possibility. Which appears to be uh, what's going to happen here. Right, good game, game three. <laughs> Ponder. Maybe he's going for a brainstorm. I don't think so. That would have been a really odd way to do that. I think they would have brainstormed off the Chrome Mox. This looks like natural ad nause to me. We're dead. How do we always have the natural ad nausea? Oh, double pedal. Yikes. Okay. I mean, this deck's almost automatic from 19. Well, they have like... two. They have played two Cabal Rituals. Uh, they don't have a way to, to, to help in. Wow, that's awful. Oh, they don't have it. Do they? Black, black. Uh, they don't have a red. They they can go Chromox pitch a black card. Do they? Yeah, no, they have it. They have it. Kills us. This is assuming they see the line. They see the line. Did you see the new, there's a new, the new Fred Force? What's that? You cut out, I didn't hear what you were saying. Uh, they just said... Uh, create two, three, one Fred Tramp creatures. And they have haste and they... Sac yeah, you're still cutting out, I can't hear you. I'm trying to minim- I'm trying to minim- Alright, run it- run it back. Hope we don't die on turn one. Yeah, I actually like surgical against, uh, test-
Celtic. Wow. Huh. I think it's... Yeah, you're cutting out bad. I haven't heard anything you've said for like a minute or two. Uh -huh. Hello? There you are. Alright. Welcome back. So, what do you think of yeah. this beauty? This is bad all around. Uh, uh, your screen went black. Oh, there it is. Uh, I think we take the one of the Chromox or the Rite of Flame. <laughs> That's pretty miserable. Uh I'm, I'm leaning toward taking the Rite of Flame and then hoping, or taking the Chromox, hope to play the Volcanic and then we can face slam the Volcanic Island. <laughs> this sounds real bad. I think I like it. It sounds really bad, but I think their hand is so loaded on payoffs, I don't think there's a, you can't take anything else. Cause that way they can't, they can't, they can't like cast, uh, like, uh, whatever. The LED does nothing. So I think we 100% just waste wasteland them. Sack the bayou. Go with Delta. Yeah, waste that shit. Never play in Urborg. <laughs> Well, they don't have any land, or board doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, 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 we might get there. Alright, we might just have the slowest kill ever. Really? Yeah, I don't know that we're gonna get there. We're gonna need them a brick for quite a few turns. <laughs> Their hand is super clunky, though. <laughs> oh, no. There's land. No. Nope. Oh, he can't do Dark Art and Red of Flame. And he's playing Cabal Rit in his list. He's playing two Cabal Rit. Alright. And what is our plus storm? In time? Alright. Oh, that was a great draw. That was a great draw. I think we take the mana. Probably. They got a couple unknowns. Let's see what they have first. Oh, they got brainstorm. They have brainstorm. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Well, it's as awkward as possible because they're gonna have all their cards but one. So. Well, if they don't have a red source, that means they can't use that red of flame. Let's. Where's their hand? Oh, you you xed out their hand? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I didn't think we did. It's on. It's in the chat. I just have to find it. Uh, I think it was Burning Wish, Infernal Tutor, and Azium. Red of flame. Yeah, that's, right. Right, that's right there. Cool. So let's see if we can figure out what they did. Whoa. So the ad noise is on top. I would take the Chrome box. Right? I agree. So come or on. actually, wait. So, Infernal Tutor, Burning Wish, Rite of Flame. So we hit ad noise and one more card. So what do we lose to? Dark Red? Three, one, four. No, we don't. No, we take the Chromox, I think. Yeah, I think I agree. This is yeah, we take, weird. We take, we take Chromox, and like, their hand doesn't really do anything. So, is Anaz on top? Plus one unknown? Here's the unknown. Plunder? No, I think, I think, I think we're fine. Because he needs another land, and then he needs he just shoved, a rich. So he has these five and a random card. Well, he doesn't want it to draw a Nas. No, no, I know, but I mean, this hand doesn't really do much of anything. I think we just play Deaths and try to make it. Yeah, or, I mean, he had, yeah. so he's got two random draws. So if he either kills us or drew a bounce spell off two random spells, we're, so we're dead. So the but... cards that kill us are Ritual, Ritual, Land Ritual? 
Uh oh. This is the the brain brainstorm that kills us. <laughs> uh, I don't know. This hand's still really clunky. I mean, if they hit land dark red, land dark red, dark red or something is probably good enough to kill us. Nope. Oh, cool. We did it. <laughs> go go Tess. Uh, we didn't really even do that crazy stuff either. We just we mana screwed them. We took a Chrome Mox, wastelanded them, and took a Chrome Mox. <laughs> that's that's basically what we did. We 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 cut them on their mana long enough to kill them. Uh, ticking. Oh my god! Could we stop drawing these hands <laughs> with five color, not five just color sources? Uh, uh, the hand looks pretty bad. I, I it's really bad. This hand is actually worse. Wow, well, we're good at this game. They mulliganed. Uh, I think we mulliganed. Or do we keep it and try to draw Hexmage? This is much better. Yeah, that looks like a So That looks still like a bottom. Yeah. Did you go? Yeah, I think so. It slows us down on certain combo hands, but... um. I think... Oh. That's not bad, actually. Uh, oh, brainstorm. What do you think he's on? Uh. Oh, look, there's a step. <laughs> <laughs> That's going to remain in our hand, too, <laughs> unfortunately. So I think here, we, we again, keep the again door. we're in the Grixis control. I guess this could be Storm again. Like we, it's Grixis, probably Storm, I always I think. think it's Grixis control or... or black red reanimator no matter what it is i think we want it to rest next turn so i think we let them take the needle and we put map put to rest map to rest yeah I, I like that line too he gets to take this like this might be a reanimator and we feel real bad but yeah, I mean, it, it doesn't look like uh I mean, we can't put them on specifically reanimator with swamp thoughts ease, so it's more likely the, storm and they seem to be it's unlikely this is a wasteland deck so Unless it's like plays the pox. plays the mirror, <laughs> could end up being pox or something like that. But plays the mirror. This seems fine. It's probably storm. If not bitter blossom. Oh, oh brutal. Uh, yeah. Well, we burr, have the burr. step, so I think we just take the him, right? Yeah, we take the him and just hope to not get snap hemmed at some him. point. <laughs> Yeah. Hope we, hope, we, hope we can kill them before they go snap him. Yeah, I, I think we take the him and then the bit of awesome's irrelevant. Yeah, they only get two draws or three draws rather. So yeah, the the third draw him. They have the flyers technically covered. Short of See, him. this is the upside of drawing step every match. What's that having to worry worry about getting it? Uh, if this gets him out of our game, hand, we just straight up lose. So we have to uh, hope that does not happen. Interesting. I think I actually would have played the Strix there if I was in their seat. So we get wrecked by Hypnotoric? Why is that not working? Uh, yes. But I don't know that they're going to want to him us. Because we, I mean, we have I the combo on the board. So, well, the thing is, you can't win without step. <laughs> but they can't possibly put us on a one of step in hand. <laughs> they, saw it, they saw it, though. They saw it, though. Oh, with the thoughts. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We didn't hide it. Yeah, no, no, they, they saw it. That's that's it, a good point. Uh, we're just going so like, to gonna have to repeat it and get there. Like, we just we only lose to him. We also lose the Edict, but whatever. Oh, we're we're losing beating, Edict. Nice. We're not beating anything. We, we multi five. We have the ability to combo. Ooh, Thoughtsies? that looks like a hero discard spell, which is amazing. Thoughtsies? Nah, Strix. Oh, whatever. It's still black. <laughs> like... Oh, no land. That's pretty sweet. Alright, no, sn no, no gets, snap games. That gets us out of snap, and that gets us away from Jace, too. Yeah, we still die to the same things. Ooh. Oh. That's interesting. Now we can cut them off a dual land if they happen to play like a ponder and then play a 
the land. Uh, I was gonna say, oh, we can GQ, but I was like, wait, that doesn't work. Oh. Alright. Does he attack here? Probably. He has no reason not to. He knows we have to step. Like, we're just dead to like Edek. We can't beat Edek, whatever. I mean, it's what it is. It is what it is. Two, three, four, five, six. They couldn't play the angler. They uh, could have. It's seven. They have seven. I don't think there's a reason to wait. To just do this. Yeah, it gives them more time to draw Edek. They have what, three on now? So. Plus no ponders, no cantrips. I mean, I guess there's no, there's no really resetting here if he waits. Um, we're gonna have to play the step. So this is this is kind of all in as it gets. There it is. That's unfortunate. Whoa, whoa, we we're, we're still. Oh wait, in he didn't. No, wait. no, he should. No, 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 no. We're still in it. We're still in it. Yeah, I don't know why he did that. We, we can draw. We can draw deaths. If we draw deaths. We can still. Oh, oh, we can stifle the, the scalding turn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're laughing, but that's going to happen. That's 100% happening. I mean, that's the hope, right? Yeah. That's I think if we drew, I think if we drew deaths there, we still had a chance. This is very unfortunate. Man, we're still good at mulligan the five today. I don't know if this turned out okay for a mold of five. That's... Whatever. I mean, we still got like three turns. Uh... He's not playing the Garmag Angler. Oh, okay. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it. We're gonna. We're gonna get us. We're gonna get the scalding turn. <laughs> it's the little victories in life, right? I mean, I, I, I still think we have a chance. I think it's a very slim chance, but we still have a chance. Like, it's unlikely, but who knows. He gave us he gave us an out, so we'll take the out, right? Yeah, well, it would have been a really bad sign if he just passed, if he just untapped, because <laughs> that would have meant every card was great. But luckily, hopefully he's drawing dead here a little bit. And his then, clock's, maybe he his clock's gonna be really fast. We need to draw a stage of adepts here. Because he's he's one hundred percent gonna play the angler now. Is that a him to Tarak? Oh we're dead. Yeah, no we're dead. Scoop it up. We're done. We are dead. <sighs> That's unfortunate. Uh closer slower. Do you like surgical on this matchup? I bring a one of in. Alright. Do you not like Safekeeper? I don't. I think it doesn't do anything in this matchup other than be an Edict of Bind. Yeah, I don't I mean, know. I, so I like much, it. They matchup. have so much removal, they can't even bring it all out. So I feel like. Yeah, K you're right. K Command. And I've seen them leave bolts in. Um, well, bolts go to the face, so there's that. Yeah. They have so many cards that need to come out that they just can't take them all out. So they can't take all their. Spot removal out with fatal pushes and it's sort of playable. Not great. That hand looks. It looks like it could use help, but I think we should keep it. Yeah, we're on the play, so. We're gonna just hope that we draw See. something relevant. See, this, this is what all my hands look like last week when I was playing Depths. This is literally what all my hands look like. And then I just never drew anything else. <laughs> yeah, this has been a uh, an evening of soft draws. We've had a lot well, of days. Oh, oh we, we can't get him to Tarak. So, yeah. that's good. That's, we'll that, both that's... of these out of our hand at the very least. You dropped Depths first though, right? Yeah. Or just place the stage and then deaths. He, unless, he can we hand draw, unless we draw a green source, yeah. If we draw a green source, I think we put the green source in. <coughs> oh, we need to watch out for Blood Moon. Yeah. They, they, they play Blood Moon. Uh, uh, I would not. I would not play that. Turning on him to Tarak is not where I want to be. Yeah, I think I agree. 
think I'll play this. I think you, just I think you play the stage. Uh, I was gonna say the depths, just in case we draw hex mage. That's true. I mean, I don't know. I, I like playing stage. What does stage actually get get us in that spot though? That's fair. All right. Let's just hope we draw a green source and hope we don't get blood moon. Uh, that's bad. Well, now we're probably dead if he plays moon. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you got us. Yeah, I mean, there's like zero threat. If this was any other land, you wouldn't just be able to do this, but... It looks like the moon is coming. Yeah. Nope. Oh, that's not a moon. What is our opponent doing? Him to Oh, sh Got me. Uh, sure, whatever. That's actually mildly annoying. That <laughs> shut our combo oh, no. off next turn. <laughs> How are we so unlucky? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> well. <laughs> Everything is going wrong. Yeah. I think we surgical the Him to I was gonna say, we bogged him. I think we surgical first. <laughs> I mean, the problem is we're gonna play this and we're gonna get chased. I mean, could we could we beat Jace anyways? If we had any untapped land, <laughs> yes. <laughs> but uh, well, we got wrecked. I, but the surgical isn't gonna do anything though. I mean, does the him do anything from this spot? So if we play bog tapped, we have the combo on play, right? I mean, so we can draw a green him? source and kill Bill. We can draw a green source, kill, kill Belfal Strix, and then they can't untap with Jason Concert Guy. That's true. I mean, how likely, are they, how, like, eh, how likely are they to have two of these and have let on Basic Island, though? It seems... Uh, I think I think they might have been Landlight, and they just don't want to get ways on it. Uh, that's fair. Like... I, think, uh, I don't know, I kind of like the idea of seeing if they have another Ponder. I think they would. I think they're either holding off Fluster Storm, which in this case we can play through it. But like, I don't know. I don't know. I think him to Torak fucks us the most because if he if he has something, we can recover from it at least. All right, I'm, I'll roll with what you got here. But I don't. I, I, I just think I that we're like unlikely. I, I just think we're just and unlikely we to just, beat anything. And we just lost the game. Oh, from the ashes. All right, scoop. We're dead. We are winning anyways. Thanks. Uh, thanks, uh, Urvork. Thanks a lot. Is there blood moon? There's no blood. Why well, is two from the ashes? Wow. So we lost. All to, right. We lost to the one of edict off the top last game. Wow. We are good at this game. We are really good to losing the herbor today. All right. Nah, fuck it. Hey, what are we conceding? <laughs> no, I'm gonna make them cast it. I was thinking about just sandbagging the Bazooka Bog, but he's just going to play from the ashes and then follow it up with Jace the next turn, which we're going to lose to, but I want to, I want him to do it. Yeah. <laughs> I want to see it. Yeah, maybe you just play Jace. How many basics does he play? I think it was four? I didn't really get a good look. Uh, Alright, out for dead. Put some of stack. Wow. GG, well, GG, well played. Wow. That was a. Uh, Herbor giveth, Herbor taketh. Uh, what was that? Two moles to five, or was that five and then a week six? I don't even remember. I think we mulligan to five, like, a lot. That's all I know. Yeah. I actually don't think that. I think that match was actually reasonably close, considering we went to five and they had two turns, that, three uh, turns to find the edict in the first game and the one of edict, and they did. And then in the second game, the him had to hit the one untapped land, or they were dead. And it did. We got we got we got punished so hard. <laughs> Everything we did just punished us. And the one of on ground sea as opposed to any other colored source, which were one again. This this was this was literally me last week. Everything I did punished me. Oh, look who it is.
Ah, uh, it's well, our favorite league, streamer. In a league where everyone, everything's going wrong, we might as well give Arkin a win. <laughs> nah, we're, we're one and two for Pride. I'm, I'm, I'm apparently his uh, arch nemesis. Can't beat me. Well, then you're, then you're calling the shots this match. Oh, uh, top season, uh... Swing Delver, maybe? Or Bomberman? I don't know. He is playing... Blade. Or a standstill. This has to be standstill, right? That looks like standstill. This is, is actually, this is actually close, right? I think you take the brainstorm. Right? No? It's close. His hand does actually nothing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, apparently he uh he agrees. He knows. His hand does nothing. Yeah. I mean, for we all we know, he's gonna draw the hand. We can't technically beat the swords yet, so. We're also ah, to find I think it's easier to beat swords than him brainstorming the three ways to beat everything we're doing. Oh, he found Ponder. When obviously we're up Tundra. What? Huh? Um, oh, interesting. Is this just a miracle? Miracles with Mitra's factory? I don't know about that. Maybe this is just a one or a two of. No sense. way, they play beat to b in this mirror in this in this world of Karn. Like, no way. I mean, he intentionally just fetched Tundra. No, no, what, no, what I'm saying is... Island. So no, no, what I'm saying is there's no way that he's not playing Sansil, mm -hmm. right? In this world of Karn? Oh, Diamond. Oh, that's like not bad. We pitch a stage. Rinse arm, shuffle. I agree. <laughs> Oh, yikes. Uh, hey, yikes, we have everything. It's pretty good, but what do we, <laughs> I think we leave. Where's the, where's the yikes? Man, think... brainstorm is hard. Uh, it's too many decisions, there's too many decisions. <laughs> coward. This is, what, this is why I play slow devs. There's no decisions like this. I just play what I'm given. <laughs> and if you give me too many choices. Uh, put the double scrying on top. Thoughtseize, play Misty? Uh, or we can wait next turn, Thoughtseize, and then hold up. That's what, um, that's what we, it would be. Yeah. But I think we have to take the plow anyway, so I don't think it matters. Oh, we can play around the next turn, so we can wait till next turn. We open them up to counter spell though. If we wait. And I think we have to take this anyway, so I think we're. I yeah, think that's fine. Just, yeah. I think it's just probably worth posting here. Yeah. Wasteland. So Wasteland. Stand so this is standstill. This is standstill with. Or maybe this is miracles. I don't think this with. is miracles with Mitra's Factory and Wasteland. This is 100% standstill. Well, why would they play Fortnite? Wow, I can't believe did that. That's wait, wait, rotate, rotate. He's dead. Yeah, I understand that. <laughs> <laughs> what is he doing? What? I'm confused. Uh, I mean, I guess it's possible his, his last card down off the ponder is an answer. Um, no, no, no. He already solved it. Right? No. No, he didn't. No, he's got one more. Well, we draw three. He's going to have to crack his... Uh, ooh. So Make he's it going to have make to... Terminus. Yeah, I think, I think we make it. Well, no, we make it now. I think we force him to have it and let him recall us. Like, yeah, like, at least we draw three. Like, whatever, man. We draw three and we already have one tutor, so... Uh, we're well on our way to making a second one. Wow. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> Alright, I'm done. <laughs> Tell him he's a luck sack. <laughs> wow. No. So his, wow. So his portent was... Um, Wasteland. 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 Cr Wasteland Caracas. Yeah. Stand still. Stand still, yeah. Wow. <laughs> well, we got played. We got played like a fiddle. Yikes.
We got we got super played. Wow. Yeah, I, I don't think about, this. I didn't care about Terminus. Terminus was okay. The, uh, this plow was okay. Mean... I didn't care about anything other than that specifically. It's probably a one of two. Uh, I don't know if slowing down. I have no idea how to board against standstill. I think you want safekeeper. Yeah, it's probably correct. It's a white deck. It's a mirror. It's basic. A stone blade deck. Yeah. What about the clock? Because needles are still useful against like Mishra's Jacker. Yeah. I don't know that any of these cards are particularly great. Nah, forget this. Uh, watch like out for um, humility. Yeah. yeah, that's why I brought the trophies in instead of the decays. Yeah, it's not the. I don't, oh, the other day, uh, I don't think they're particularly good either. Um, yeah, it's possible. I think a few a few weeks ago, I I, I managed to beat miracles through humility. That was, that was insane. Yeah, this board was one hundred percent wrong. <laughs> whatever, whatever. But yeah, we're we're we're, we're one two. We can uh, let this go. Uh, this was a punt stream, anyways. Yeah. I mean, what is our uh, what is our total record this stream? What? Uh, two one and then one two, so three three. Yeah, we want, yeah, we're three and three. We're fifty percent. That's not that bad. Three and three, but we definitely punted against goblins, and we definitely punted against <sighs> the very first match that I don't remember. Oh no, we came back and won that game. Okay. So, you no, know, we we won that match. Yeah, so we punted against goblins. I don't think there was well, much we could have done. Our, our Arkin, our Arkin totally like sacked us there though. Yeah, that was a pretty good uh, important. Off yeah, of, like his hand off was, the top. His hand, his hand didn't do anything. There. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever. This was the perfect time to have it happen when our league was already tanked. Yeah, our league is trash anyways. We weren't winning anything. Might as well be tilt out of the way, right? <laughs> <laughs> I think this was like that time I was playing versus him, and he drew Terminus flying. That's a key. It's right. Seems good. It's okay. alright, because it beats standstill naturally, or at least harasses standstill naturally. We can get this down, it's... we can get this down under a standstill to answer in Wasteland or Caracas. I think we played Dress first, right? Yeah. Plays so around the a spell pair? Sure. Or Foster Storm. Huh. So. You want to take Source to Flash Shares and try to hope it'll work? Or is that not good enough? I think that's the line. Yeah. I mean, he has the Snapcaster, so it's going to be ugly no matter what. It's possible Brainstorm's correct and then try and enlighten or map into a Wasteland and take him off entirely. Seems slow versus a basic stack. They have all the basics. Slow. I think that's cool. I'm going to take Source of Flashers and he hope he doesn't get lucky like that. He not only has the Snap Plow, but he's also going to Enlighten Tutor into Humility if he can get to that amount of mana. So. We're playing like, I mean, we also died to, um, what's it called? Uh, Repel, if he says it. Uh, uh Yeah, he would need to find both halves of that, though. I don't think yeah, he's, I mean, he's on that. Energy, or not, not Repel, um, Energy Field. Yeah. We Maybe may you just filters. We may end up. Maybe you might brainstorm for us all. It's possible. Maybe you brainstorm for us all. That'd be cool. Like you might feel priced into uh, brainstorming the force all. No. This is pretty up good there, because up now, there he is. Needs to, now he needs to have multiple lands <coughs> or land and cantrip in the top three. So yeah, I mean he can she can shuffle. He's online tutor. You can fail to find, but he can trouble. Sure, but that's that means he's not drawing a land the turn he enlightened tutors. Unless he's got an artifact yeah. land, which I don't think he does. Enli enlightened tutor for Pithing Needle. Uh, that would be rough. Yeah, that would be annoying. Uh, whatever. It's a 1-2 it's a league. We can do whatever we want. We've kind of this is a hard break. Yeah, that's the one thing we have going for us is we kind of break the stand still, so you may have to shuffle that away. Like if you don't waste that, we lose, but whatever. All right. Uh, depends. If he fires it off, we have a second depths. Um, he won't fire it off. If he doesn't, it's no way. 
Oh, here comes the There's no way he fucking. Here comes oh, your needle there it is. line. <laughs> Called it. Fails to find an artifact. Ah, see, I, th I was also a line I thought of. Yikes. Uh. This is okay. Cantrip. This is another cantrip. I think he just wanted to shuffle. He just wants to get the three lands. Yeah. Uh, why is he playing pork? Like, no is there there's probably terminus in this list? Uh, it's possible. All right. He almost one hundred percent has the um. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. oh, we beat Wasteland. But we don't beat the Source of Hush here. Did he find land? Or just find another plow? Like, we still lose to another plow. Yeah, I mean, this is bad. He published... This is bad because we have nothing going on as far as interaction, and he could have drawn any number of cards. Yeah, he shuffled away. He probably shuffled away to Ferry. Wasteland stalls his turn. We kept off the Portent, so there was something there he wanted. Any additional plow? Uh, he, he, probably he probably shuffled off the Teferi. He probably shuffled off the Teferi when he had mine tutored. Alright, so he has Snap Plow. Alright, we are dead. Is that Surgical Extraction? Uh, I did not. Ah, maybe we should have. <laughs> there's only so many. There was only so many slots to actually mess with, right? I don't know. I'm a fan of taking out some number of depths versus white decks. So, here we could go for Wasteland and see if that's all he's on a Snap Plow, or what are we? Or we could we get, get bog. We can or we bog. Could get, well, we could bog too. Or we could. That's good. Or we could get Let's another get stage and combo twice. Uh, I mean, he we know he has Snapcaster Mage, right? Sure. I think we bog here and put him to the test. Land. Oh my god. <laughs> We're so good at this. Like, you might just try to get some Snapcaster value here. With, with uh, Brainstorm. That's scary. Right? No? Not. Oh, well, okay. We're dead. <laughs> oh, we're dead. Alright. We're dead. That's an interesting Brainstorm. We need, we need a brainstorm. Do you do you go nice. for it? I don't think I don't know if we can go for it. I don't believe we can. No. I think we just copy an island. Christ. B two B. Uh. He is wow. Likely. Well, that's not even the one he had. So. <laughs> Oh, we don't even know what he has. You told me shuffle away standstill. There's no way. Alright. There's no way he has it. This is so bad. It shuts off our fluster storms and crop rotations, too. Copy the island, right? <laughs> Wait. This would have been good this is a just, few turns ago. This is just what, last now. Yeah. All right. That's just classic. Um, if we if we draw another land, I'm willing to pack it in. I don't know about you. <laughs> this is the third end of end of turn brainstorm. He's just wrecking us. Nah, where, where is that? I can't thought these hit lands. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't Thalsies just hit lands? I probably even, I probably shouldn't even play this. I probably should play the the uh, ghost quarter. All right. Uh, how much how much do you think uh, how much you want to bet he has a council's judgment too? Deck seems like it has a lot of weird cards. I'd be interested to see his list. Maybe we'll go back and watch his stream after. Yeah, it's blue white. You can always expect blue white things, right? I mean, he's had a little bit of everything. We've seen 
Wasteland, we've seen Caracas, we've seen Portents. It's, it's a little wild. I think he was playing this after after uh, he got tired of losing with Delver. <laughs> uh, when I was watching, he's like, I'm done with this Delver deck. I'm going to go play this something just, else. This is just getting amusing. Okay. How many, pieces, uh... how many pieces of protection that we can't cast can we actually find? Yeah, no, this was my experience with Teferi in Modern too. when I played Teferi. Card is dumb. Card is dumb. Speed portent. <laughs> <laughs> you got us. That's possible. We haven't, seen a, we haven't seen a Narset yet, but that's entirely possible. There's always a Narset, dude. <laughs> if he isn't playing a Narset, I'm shocked. Well, um, huh. Maybe we can draw an abrupt decay. <laughs> Alright, on the plus side, he's not doing anything. It's true. We can uh, start buying out deaths if you want. Yeah. Why not, right? <laughs> not doing anything else. I guess the other line we could theoretically take is just try to combo twice. Which now we have, naturally. Well, maybe our opponent, maybe he'll play a Blast Zone. <laughs> he can copy the Blast Zone. I mean, he hasn't been making, there we go. It's because he hasn't been making land drops either, so the seven cards in his hand are all gas. Hey, hey, we can copy the Mischief Factory and start beating down. Uh, no, that doesn't work. Well, yeah, I guess we could. We could go score. <laughs> Actually, that's... That's actually... Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's, do it. Let's copy it. Well, Let's I mean, copy no, it. We can get... That's actually good. We can actually get Teferi off the table. Yeah, we can copy the Mishras. I like Go that. End I step. like that a yeah. lot, actually. This this used to be my plan against miracles back in the day. Yeah, we, yeah, we have we have we have GQ. Like, yeah, this is great. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Interesting. Oh wait, we can do this hex and kill the Teferi. Yeah, I think that's actually. Better. I like, I like that line more. Well, assuming it resolves, he has five mana up. I mean, he can't. He won't force a will. You think he does have a Teferi? No, no, I, no. As I'm like, he won't hard cast force a will. He'll have at least two for one himself if he's using force a will. I think you dump the hex mage off the Death's plus Herborg and like. You know, you gotta hope, right? I think this is getting forced. If he forces, at least we don't have to ghost quarter this. Snapcaster. Oh, uh, counter spell. All right. So the problem with attacking with more than so, one is we don't have a combo up if we do that. Well, you can attack a one, and then if he blocks, we can pump it. <laughs> and then we can main phase crop rotate for another Thespian stage. <laughs> like that doesn't sound that bad, right? No. Problem is, I don't like we can. I don't want to give him a window to resolve Jace. That's the problem. I mean, we can beat up the Jace with the factory. Well, this card's a problem too. I don't want this in play either. He might not even have that in his hand. He shuffled. He, he shuffled. Remember. Yeah, I guess it is possible that he does not know. Like, I think, I think activating Mishra's and attacking and seeing if he wants to block. Like, I don't think he's gonna trade. Right. <laughs> it's so dumb. All right, whatever. All right, fly land. They go. We weren't likely to win this anyway, so the, sh the spare, the spare swords to plowshare to start throwing at factories. Yeah, like oh, this the fairy is just absolutely wrecking us. Okay. Nope. Or land. Or even like a disc. Uh, anything. 
So at least he's not. Well, at least he's not doing anything. Yeah. Say go. I was thinking of crop rotting into another stage. Go for it. Probably Snapcatcher. It's fine. We gotta get the stuff out of his hand at some point, right? Yeah. Oh well, we're so far behind. It's like whatever. We're getting crushed. To ferry making his uh his his, uh, his 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 presence known. Oh. Are we just gonna copy another Mistress Factory? I believe that is the play, yeah. And then he's gonna snap yeah. the plow. <laughs> and that and that's how we lose. Yeah, I I'm 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 very close to saying we are dead. I mean if we draw abrupt I don't even think abrupt decay gets us out. Right? Probably not at this point. Like, we haven't seen a thought so we haven't seen anything. Well, we eventually have to start drawing real cards. Ah, you say that. We can thaw this one out and then play the other one. <laughs> hey, look at that. Hey, discard spell. <laughs> Maybe it's got some... We, I, think we, I, think we, I think we sandbag it. No. No, we have to see what, nah. what we're playing against before we start attacking into God knows what. Oh, I, 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 I like I like, I like the sandbag and I draw more. Or at least get the Snapcaster Mage out of his hand somehow, so we at least know what we're looking at. Yeah, he probably just lets it resolve and looks at our hand, and we're just like, well, I guess we can't win. He's got another counter spell. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm gonna oh. hold the Misty. How many brainstorms do we have? Uh, have four? I think three. I think I boarded one out. Well, we're on he's not doing anything. Six. Like, it's a good thing this doesn't have an ultimate. <laughs> yeah, like if it's a very an ultimate, we were just dead a long time ago. But you know, Insist Terminus got us. <laughs> Are we just thawing out? Yeah, why not, right? Yeah. <laughs> wow. Let's get out of stage. We're running out of stages. <laughs> this will be the last one. I right, let it go. I'm half tempted to just get a wasteland here. Is that worth it? So let's say we have two. Well, we have the GQ anyways. I guess the speed's wasteland. He has five cards in hand, man. Right. More, 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 more factories, right? Yeah, I'm thinking about it. So these, factories all, these, for everyone. These lines seem terrible, all of them. But every, I mean, we haven't seen a, we've only seen one hex mage. Like, uh, so I don't think we had any good lines, honestly. This Fluster storm is so dead. Oh, he's feeling, he's feeling ahead. He's going for his fourth end, end step brainstorm. <laughs> or maybe he's going to portent again. There we go. Man, we suck at drawing cards. I think we're at the point where maybe we should be attacking him. <laughs> Not as <to> ferry. <laughs> this thing is getting so far out of reach. I mean, I think it's been out of reach for a while. But... Yeah, no. Maybe he'll disconnect or something. I don't know. <laughs> I 
oh, he's confident enough to play like a victim right now. Ooh, ooh, that's uh, the sweet bounce. He do it. He drew two cards, dude. That's okay. All right, copy Mistress Factory. Try to draw another discard spell. <laughs> We're almost there. Oh, we we had the main phase that. God damn it. Yeah. I think we try. Yeah, there's no real reason not to. Yeah, like I don't I don't want him to go like he might just like Snapcaster and then try to bounce the fairy again. Like that might happen. <laughs> actually actually we attack him. He can snap count yeah, us too. Which is all Yeah, whatever. He has all sorts whatever. of options. Watch him let it go and then just play another Teferi and then it's like, well, I guess we're dead. Yeah, he's gonna snap. Oh, he's gonna hard cast force. There we go. Yeah, Alright, right, that's attack. Let's wait, 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 no. No, make no, I think I think we swing with a crew. Oh, uh, and get the snap plowed. I, I think I think we swing two guys at him, and then if he blocks we can pump the other one. Uh, or we, we can pump the one he doesn't. Yeah, whatever. Hey, we can thaw it down to one. <laughs> we are on our way. Clearly. Do we have good draws? Not really. Do you think he'll deck? Not really. He's got, think multiple, he'll... He's got multiple. Uh, there we go. All right, let's brainstorm and see if he like, lets it go. There we go. Hey, real cards. So this is garbage. Oh, nope. That's actually pretty good. And this is garbage. Alright, let's start getting some cards out of his hand. Step one. Here comes the snappy boy. Snapcaster brainstorm. <laughs> For like the fifth time, sixth time. Oh, Counterspell. All right, that got me. We we, we tried. <laughs> yep. All right. Now we try again. <laughs> Did we finally get to see his hand? Did we finally get to see the hand? Of how hard we're losing. Oh man. How many hard counter spells does this deck run? That's the third one. How many counter spells did he play? This is the third actual counter spell this game. Because he flashed the... one back to this one he's cast twice. Right. And then he's got two. I think we swing there. the crew at him. Yeah, I, I think we that is. I think I think we have to swing the crew at him. Got to remember to upkeep yeah. fetch. <laughs> yeah. We have to hit the Teferi, or else he's going to bounce the Snapcaster Rage again. Yeah. Oh, God, Teferi is gross. But I already knew that. So. We have to just swing with two, right? Yeah, we swing with two. We swing two at um, see which one he blocks. Then we pump the one fighting Snapcaster Mage, I think. Or we try to trade it off. Because he might just plow the one that Actually, he blocks. Maybe we should go his quarter this. In response, we can. Fucking plow. Alright. Can't say I'm not. I wasn't expect. Alright, cool. I think we have to let it go, right? Yeah, you can't activate think, the mistress. I think we also need to. Um... You can't activate it. No, 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 no. I'm saying I think we need to ghost quarter mistress factory, so we can't Why? block with this. We need him to block with this or get this down to the point where he has to kill it to bounce this. No, no, no. He he can't block with the factory. Oh, he used his mana. You're right. Okay. Yeah, no, no. He can't block. I gotcha. Yeah. So there's no reason. So like, all right. So he plows. 
if he blocks with the Mishra's, he loses or the Snapcaster Mage, he loses the Snapcaster Mage. Uh, do we pump? I think we pump it. Or do we pump it? Yeah, I think so. I think if you pump it, that means he can't minus. I mean, TV untaps and slams back to basics. We just said, but whatever, right? Pretty much. They got us. We'll just scoop then. We could actually still make a lodge, believe it or not. We could just play two lands. We don't. We don't have a fourth stage, though. Oh yeah, we can. We just You're right. Fall it off any two lands. We're actually slowly whittling his hand away. <laughs> it's taking forever, <laughs> but it is happening. There's a reason it's called standstill. Wow. Oh, we're dead. Yeah, that's not a good. Uh, that's not a good sign. We're 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 guaranteed dead if he did that. He is another one. He's on us. He's on us up well. Hey, are we out of fetch pulse? No, I got one more. <laughs> Bounce <laughs> He's got. I don't know. We didn't bounce it, so maybe there's uh, a non-zero chance this resolves. Well, he, well, he he couldn't bounce it last turn. No, no, no. I know. I'm saying it's it's still in play. So maybe he has to either use another real card, or uh... we're still fighting. <laughs> <laughs> I think I would have fallen asleep by myself if I was playing this matchup. I'm getting there. So I'm, I'm feeling sleepy playing we this matchup. We were special. so amazingly behind, so the fact that he even has to make Jesus Christ a fifth hard card. <laughs> this, is, this, is a, us. this is a record for me. I don't believe I've ever been hard counterspelled five times in a game. I'm impressed. How does he only have three cards in hand? Because we've been... <laughs> Well, he let the brainstorm resolve. That was that was All the right. first step. Uh, that made him. <laughs> All right. I think I think we attack the one of the factories. What does that actually do? It tries to kill the Teferi. He can. It makes him. He can block, and then we can pump it. Like. Sure. Because we can still active. We can still activate the death straight off, just like you know, fake mana. <laughs> All right. Like. I think we attacked a fairy. Like, how many source of flashes have we burned? We've earned two? Like, he's used two Snapcaster mages? Like. So, do we let him do this or do we ghost quarter? Uh, we ghost. We, we let him. Yeah, we ghost quarter it. Yeah, we GQ it. He could be, holding, he could be holding a Caracas because he's been sandbagging cards for quite a while. Probably has a source of flashes as well. <laughs> Let's get this game moving. <laughs> like, even though this is like, I feel like this game shouldn't be this close. He failed to find a land. <laughs> He's out of basics. <laughs> it's the small victories in life, right? Yeah, I uh, got a pump. Pump for what? No. Oh, oh that's a good call. No, oh, we lost. Oh. No. All right, we 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 no, because then we gotta keep the mistress. All right, we now we're probably dead. Yeah, that was bad. All right, whatever. I got this one. Did you add the pun count? I tried. It doesn't look like it actually worked. I believe even the MTG bot has retired because this game is miserable. Uh, punt. I'm very sleepy. <laughs> Did we, did we finally draw a spell that was relevant? No, but I think I'm actually going to force him to plow again here. Are we making it? Are we making Merit Leech? I mean, we have the second depths. So there's really no reason not to, right? Yeah, fuck it. Let's do it. Let's make him kill it. Let's. <laughs> make him kill it. We, we dumped 27 damn mana into this stupid thing. Let's make him do it. Whatever, you got me. Gotta, gotta play the depths first. Don't go when I get surgical. Uh, All right, whatever. Go to combat. I don't think there's a particular to... reason to do anything besides attack. Should we, should we attack to fairy? <laughs> no, let's just attack him. Like, whatever, man. <laughs> Maybe he just dies. 
What if? Hardcast Terminus? CJ? Hardcast Terminus? <laughs> <laughs> they got me. You know what's amazing about this is if I hadn't been an idiot last turn, we'd have actually had a profitable attack here. We all right, whatever. Cool. Your results. Right, let's let's brainstorm into a discard spell here. This is our chance. This is actually our chance to do something. God damn discard. It. <laughs> so do we tro? We can't actually. Plus this. Oh, we can trophy. So the crop rotation does actual. Probably does actual nothing. If only we had a. Well, if only we had that. Fancy. If only we had that extra mistress factory, bro. <laughs> so I think. So if we trophy. Huh. Like. All right. Like. I got a plan. You got a plan. You got a plan. I have a plan. So we're gonna try and trophy this here. It's got yet another counter spell. So be it. Um, if this manages to go away, we're, Wait, gonna, we... we're gonna try and crop kill him next turn. If this actually manages to work. Man, we're still playing in this turn fifteen. <laughs> We have six uh, we, minutes. Uh, we have six minutes left to win. Oh, what we, the fuck! Uh, we were locked out of uh, playing spells other than sorcery speed, which is why we didn't oh, storm in response uh, he, to the terminus. He just knocked his survival at Snapcaster Mage, by the way. Ah, that's another one. <laughs> Jesus. Do we? Do we? Do we just scoop? <laughs> <laughs> because we're gonna time now. That's, I mean, at this point, what was the other card besides that was crop rotation? Dude, it'd be so good if we just had another Vicious Factory right now. Ugh. Yeah, I believe we, we've we played this game hastily on many fronts. I believe bogging them as early as we did was a mistake, um, because here we could actually crop their entire graveyard. Wow, he's just firing this all. He's going to rebuy it. <laughs> He's gonna revive no, no, uh, the Noctis Revival. Yeah, if we'd have left the, the cards that weren't. Uh, this is unfortunate. If we didn't bog so if we didn't bog so early, we'd have had um, a much better way to fight this right now. And then obviously, <laughs> for... obviously the Mishra's Factory play was really good too. Uh. Yeah, I think if we had the Mishra's Factory, I think we were in a good spot. But now we're. See, I've been saying we've been dead for the past 10 turns, but we're not dead. No, we really are dead here. He's gonna, are we? He's going to rebuy this multiple times, plus whatever this finds. Plus, we don't have an answer to any of his lands, so any Wasteland, any Caracas um, is going to be a problem. Unless this resolves. Ask him, just show me Caracas, and I'll scoop. <laughs> I don't think he has it. I think that would be in play right now. Um, and Flusterstorm's our next draw, which does nothing. I really want to see his list. I can't wait to go back to his stream and actually look at his list. Because it seems so pod. odd that he would go through. This is, this is, this is pod racing, right? <laughs> well, he shuffled that time. Oh, uh, we have a chance. Probably not, so. but... I don't think so, but... Yeah. He's going to bounce it. They were dead. Hey, he might deck. Yeah, I don't think we have enough time to deck him. I'm not manual falling out again, for what it's worth. <laughs> I don't have it in me. <laughs> I don't have it in me either. I'd rather just scoop than manually fall it out again. Is he playing Big Fairy? Can we just scoop to that one? Yeah, probably. Ask him. Go like, if you have Big Fairy, we'll just scoop. I think that's what's coming down here. Maybe. All right, all right, all right. Give, 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 give it a, give it a GG. We're done. <laughs> all right. Yeah, give it a GG. 
Good times. GG. All right. Speaking of, I got work in the morning, so I'm gonna call it a night. All right. I'm, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna call it too. That was incredibly uh, exciting. Yeah, I'm probably gonna delete this vod. <laughs> I don't want this to be out there. Well, we thought we'd be goblins. Wait, we didn't be. Did no, we be we, goblins? We punted against goblins. Oh, you're right. So. All right. All right. Well. Thanks we can for, try again uh, next week. We can try it again sometime. We can, we can try and do something that's even a little bit better yeah. than what we did tonight. Yeah. All right. Take it easy, man. Thanks for watching, guys.